Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello. We're back. It's been a while. Yeah, totally. It's been... <laughs> Lauren, what, what, what year is it? Who's president? <laughs> Ronald Reagan. Again? <laughs> oh, hi, but Joey. Yes, hello, hello, everybody. Hello, Fidel. Ho Waldo, I found him. Oh, my. He's here? He's the Waldo is here, Lauren. Holy cow. We really are, we really did make it to the big leagues. Ah, oh, yeah. You know it's you know it's big when Waldo's hiding in our audience. Now if we get but Carmen then again, San, he, he, now if we get Carmen Sandiego, oh, does that mean we we're really the, hit the big time? Does that mean our place is a really good hideout? Yes, we are. For totally legal things. Like drawing. <laughs> but yes, yes, hello everyone. Our little thing should pop up. Oh no, where where's Where's our little guys? Where's our the the script? Uh, I'm looking at our our thing. It's like where did where did we go? Hello, oh, no. little guys. We're just hiding off camera. We're just we're hiding off camera. Where, where did we? Where did I go? I I okay. It shows that I'm here. But where am I? Oh. It's okay. It's okay. I, 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 I know what to do. We just won't have PNG tubers today, but that's fine. You don't need our faces. Oh God. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, but yes. Hello, everyone. We are. Yeah. Welcome. 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 So this is going to be a little bit different of an episode. Mm -hmm. uh, we are not just doing drawings today. I know. No. Nope. We, are, we are doing drawings, but we're also going to be going back to the past and just doing some mm -hmm. fun, like, watching stuff with you guys. So for the first hour of the stream, we're going to be we're going to be watching uh, some good old nostalgic commercials and also some weird commercials uh, y'all submitted to Lauren. Uh, the other day yeah that's and, why and now you guys know why i asked for for those you know those commercials because we were planning this and yeah, yeah surprise surprise just, it wasn't uh, just for her own health <laughs> yeah we're so yeah so basically we're running it the exact same way we do the other streams in terms of you know if you want to submit you know anything donations through through coffee and all that kind of stuff you are more than welcome to do it um, and you can do them do during the drawing hours since we are planning on doing, uh, depending on how this goes, we're trying to do two drawing hours, mm -hmm. but they will be broken up across uh, the di different activities we got going on here. Yeah. So, so, we, so um, if yeah. you guys want to get your stuff in for the uh, for this today, uh, mm -hmm. maybe submit your commissions during the uh, during the commercial hour. Yeah, because this this means yes, you get one extra hour in the ball pit. I mean, <laughs> one whole extra hour. Like, do you know <laughs> one how whole many extra hour kill for those extra hour? Yeah, no, you're getting one whole extra hour to uh, basically get the the stream discount, the pre stream discount price. Exactly. So if you want to get your slots in, you get one extra hour to do so. Yeah, before we crank up the prices like Wendy's with their with their Dave's founders juniors or whatever they call them. Mm -hmm. I I find Wendy's doing surge pricing at their drive throughs. Yeah. That's a crime. I view I think that it, as I a think crime. they even said that I think if I remember it there was enough backlash that I think they said they're rolling it back. Like they said that they're rolling back the decision on a number of their locations because they went that didn't go over well with the public, obviously. So. Huh. Wow. What a shock. A shitty decision <laughs> goes wrong. More at eleven. But yes, so let me turn off that sick lo-fi. So we have the playlist, but first I wanna just put on some some good 90s stuff to warm warm us up. 
Mm -hmm. So uh, this is volume 533, not to be mistaken with volumes uh, 1 through 532. Oh, wow. Of good old I mean, 90... props to whoever makes the volumes. <laughs> yeah, for good old 90s television. So I hope you guys all got your uh, bowls of cereal and your, uh, God, uh, Power Rangers pajamas on. It's time for some good old commercials. You can hear it just fine, right? Yeah. Hooray. Fidel, these are 90s commercials. Mm-hmm. Oh boy, a novel. Uh, it, this is not a no this is, 90s. This is ad not here. a 90s this is, this is this is a, a a current commercial for something now, but based on nostalgic Baby, properties, obviously. So, so um, now we, we should be starting. Oh, Mac Mike Attack! <laughs> Mac Attack! The Hamburglar hit the second tower. Don't you just love them? And they're on sale. Right now, get a filet of fish or McChicken for just 99 Ugh. cents. Well, that's great, but America craves change. That's why I crave them. They're a great change of pace. Or in the morning, get a sausage McMuffin with egg for 99 cents. But what about the issues? Wow, issues looks so appetizing. American sandwich sale for very short If you got issues, here's a tissue. The Great American Sandwich Sale. <laughs> I... Because no, nothing says great American sandwiches like the filet of fish at McDonald's. I I mean, only an American would eat a filet of fish. Um, I, I, it just it sounds no. Only Americans <laughs> would have. The I know it's still around. Their... I know. I'm like it's never sounded appealing to me, and I like fish. Yeah. I just wouldn't trust fish at McDonald's. You know what I mean? Yeah. No. No. No, I get it. I just also, <laughs> only Americans would have the trust in fast food restaurants to eat <laughs> a fast food fish. That's why Long John Silver's yeah, is a thing. That is true. There's not as many Long John Silver's, at least as far as California, I think. But yeah, There's one connected to uh, a KFC nearby me. Much. Is that Little a wave, brother? Oh, this is for pizza! pizza. Crust. Oh, oh, ew, Little Caesars. Excuse me? <laughs> we will not, we will not slander How Little Caesars. I am, and... No, I am Brutus with the knife, and <laughs> they will, <laughs> et, I'm going to et to his brute. Like, I, I do not like Little Caesars. I'm, see, I'm in... I think it's because maybe I didn't grow up with as much of it, but I got a lot more of it when I was an adult. Once I was an adult. Because then I went, you know what? I, I didn't have this enough of this as a kid, so maybe, maybe that's why I, I I don't have that kind of perspective. Of okay, it. yeah, sure. I I'm not going to hear, uh, but also, hear anything you... from a Little Caesar centralist. <laughs> <laughs> The Ides of March have already passed. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. I, I'm just really proud of myself for that one. Going to give myself a little high five. <laughs> uh, but also personally, I I personally dig their little pizza cups because you get those are actually pizza pretty cups? good. They have these little like they're like little. They almost think of like imagine if it's like a cupcake, but it's a little like a cupcake shaped little pizza. They're like, yeah, it's like, a, almost imagine like a bread roll if you turned it into a pizza. Uh-huh. Like that size. Okay. You can look them up. But yeah, they're actually pretty good. <laughs> and sure. they, t and especially if you get like the garlic and herby one, if you guys get any of those, like the garlic and herb one, especially like I actually even the pepperoni one's pretty good, but the getting cheesy garlic bread. Remember, folks, every every dollar you send Lauren is another reason she doesn't have to eat Little Caesars so she can have a less garbage <laughs> opinion. I love Look, you, Lauren. Like... You're my sister. <laughs> I, I, you are better Look, than I like Little Caesars. You think coffee is soup. Uh... <laughs> okay, These, this is a straw man argument and there's a bear behind this man. <laughs> 
knotted black Angus. Grilled top sirloin with pan roasted garlic, barbecued baby back ribs, and a junior wild baby back, West baby onion. back, baby back. Oh, Nothing is this an Outback commercial? I was gonna say, is this? Yeah, that, I mean, it's a blooming <laughs> onion. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was, I was, not, I was not prepared for that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was a terrible time for my mouth to be filled with food. <laughs> Can we please re <laughs> California Can we commercial please jump scare? Yeah, I'll go back a little bit. <laughs> Baby oh, ribs, I wish we got ready. Your wild west onion. There's nothing better. <laughs> Garlic, barbecue ribs, and your old Wild West onion just tonight. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Black Angus. Oh, it's Black Angus. Wait, they have blooming onion? Okay, this tells you how it's, much no, I've no, gone to a Black it's, Angus, it's, which it's is called, never. Um, no, they but, have a blooming onion? It's, it's called, uh, well, to the stream, it looks like Black Angus because I'm covering up part of the commercial. But, like, no, it was a Western onion. <laughs> Not oh, a blue onion. I'm sorry. Because legally, I'm sorry. It's so different. <laughs> well, in the eyes of the My law, mistake. yes. <laughs> Cut. Lunch. Mr. Quinn, any advice for hungry young actors? You know, true greatness comes from within. I mean, you can't see it, but you can smell it and taste it. You gotta have it inside, deep down, hidden. You're so passionate about acting. Who's talking about acting? I'm talking about. Pizza. The new triple decker pizza from Pizza Hut. I'm talking about <laughs> pizza. And oh, and he's talking about Pizza Hut. <gasps> okay, yeah. Pizza Hut's worse. Come on. Look, yeah, that's why I do that. Look, that's what I'm saying. I don't no matter how much you don't like little Caesars, let's agree that Pizza Hut is is we well, could both agree that we don't like Pizza Hut. <laughs> yes. Yes. No Pizza is everyone's fourth option in a three person race. <laughs> like <laughs> I, Look, I remember as a kid, I would go, like, I would get the little, you know, personal pizzas as a kid, because they had, like, the, the reading, you know, when they would do, like, the, the yeah, reading the logs, like, the reading. reading thing. Yeah, and then you get the little medal and a personal pizza, and yeah, it's yeah. like... Fabio. His no oh no, he's back! Something's happening in black. <laughs> no! Is he gonna scream at the horse now? With your choice of either grill, cowboy, chicken, the horse is here. Ribs, shrimp, <laughs> horse, the cowboy is here. Build a prime rib combo with chicken <laughs> ribs, shrimp, and prawns, just eleven ninety nine. That's what I like about the horse Black wakes Angus. up. It's like, oh, okay, the cowboy they was just a dream. Working stiff, need a little comfort food. <laughs> oh. Huh? New Wait, what happened? He's... So <laughs> he hammer did he hammer the nail into the horseshoe with his hand? What a... No, no, we gotta rewind this. We gotta yeah, rewind on, this. I need to process. On. I won. I fixed the PNG tubers. We're now visible. Hooray. Okay, yeah. <laughs> but okay, let's see what let's see what happened there. Let let's 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 dig this plot. Let's game theory it. Okay. Build a prime rib combo with chicken, rib, shrimp, or prawns, just eleven ninety nine. That's what I like about Black Angus. They know us working stiffs need a little comfort food. <laughs> he did. He did. <laughs> even even you're the scared. horse is concerned. <laughs> but but he's why? Like, though? He has this, he's like he's like Clint. If Clint Eastwood was like, I don't Not know if you hinge? can say it was like he's. Yes. Oh my if god, you Clint know what it is? Clint Eastwood it's the was even more it's, unhinged. <laughs> it's the fusion of Clint Eastwood with Gary Busey energy. Yes! Oh my, can you imagine it, Gary Busey in a western? I want one now. Now We now need a spaghetti western with Gary Busey in like the role, in like the role that would normally go to Clint Eastwood. <laughs> Just to see what would happen. Can, okay, so here's my pitch of like what we need to do. Follow me on mm -hmm. this. So we All need right. to make a spaghetti western script and mm -hmm. contact Clint Eastwood and Gary Busey's agents. Just them. Mm -hmm. Make sure that they both audition for the role and have them both there when we pick it, bachelorette style with a rose. <laughs> <laughs> Gary Busey, will you accept this rose? <laughs> 
Okay. Wendy's new country French chicken tastes Oh, Wendy's. Delicious. Wow, a lot of food commercials. Bonjour. It has mm -hmm. everyone speaking French. Could it be Wendy's country French roll? The Swiss top with the end. Or Wendy's whole breast fillet. <laughs> oh, what was that fit that the construction worker had on? Wait, I'll hold up. Let's see. Or Wendy's whole breast fillet. Oh, hello. Hello. What is. Is that like a belt? Or is he like just Disney bounding Charlie Brown? Like, what's happening here? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, it almost looks like it would be like a back brace of some sort, like for, you know what I mean? Bonjour, mes amis. <laughs> this man has never seen France outside of a fry. Like, <laughs> he's gotta be stopped. Come try Wendy's new country. <laughs> she speaks for all of us. <laughs> At Indiana, you'll be on national TV. Oh, Indiana jump scare. Ew, Indiana. Degree. And all the crunchy tacos you can eat. Soft taco. Crunchy. Soft. Crunchy. Soft. Another double deck of taco, son. Thanks, coach. 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 Now try the bacon double deck. <laughs> what if that, what if he <laughs> just had a little corner thing that said, like, New York Governor Andrew Cuomo? <laughs> <laughs> it's not, but wouldn't it be funny? <laughs> from Taco Bell. That would be so out of left field. For one big sizzling taste. A little something for the road, boys. It's Garth like Brooks I am just waiting it. for. Garth Brooks, guest on Muppets tonight. Oh, it's Muppets tonight! Oh wow! presents a new kind of on back when they had TGIF <gasps> on ABC. <laughs> oh! oh. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> Grogu. What? What the? Oh, it, it's fucking Roger from, from American Ted. Hi, Lego. You came in during Lego's this fucking here. thing. Hi, Lego. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm trying not to choke. I was. Because, I... <laughs> real. What is that? What is that? I was in oh, the nineties, and I don't even. Oh, oh no, no, no! Aliens in the fa okay in the family. Okay, we gotta look this up. <laughs> oh, I like that the first result with it was aliens in the attic. That one movie with like, also Josh yes, hi Spade. We're not doing art till seven. Hey Spade, <laughs> if you wanna if you wanna come, if you wanna come in for the commercial, yeah, thing, actually, hop in general, yeah, and we'll pull you no, in, uh, yeah. Please, please, Spade. <laughs> we could, we could all, we could all laugh and. There we go. Yes, come right in. Yeah, for the commercial <laughs> stuff, we could have other people. The drawing thing is simply. Uh, yeah, the drawing thing is just better to isolate it to just two people because, because of, of the, the screen share. Just too many. Okay, so. Yeah. <laughs> Aliens in the Family, was a science fiction fantasy sitcom, that aired from March fifteenth. To August 31st, 1996. It had eight episodes. Oh my god. And Spade is Hello, here. Hello, Spade. <laughs> Hi. You came in while we look up weird alien baby. Yeah, that's what I saw when I opened the stream. <laughs> I'm sorry. Are you? <laughs> no. Okay, so the so the episode <laughs> names are Meet the Brodies, Bobbit Conquers All. Wait, is the baby's name the okay, what? The alien's name is Snizzy. Snizzy. Oh no, that the, push down Snizzy, like, my Snizzy. You know when you have, <laughs> it's like you know when you can tell when there's like a like a period of time where when you name certain characters like types of characters certain things and you go oh that is so 80s or so nice I'm like, that is very nice i'm the baby Something gotta about love me i'm the baby gotta, love, gotta me. love me oh i hate it i mean but do you look at that baby and say that's a snizzy i don't think so i look it's... at that baby and think that thing probably shouldn't have <laughs> i'm not gonna finish that sentence yeah my god. <laughs> oh, it kissed him. Oh, no. 
I don't like that it's skin toned. One attacks from the air. One is the newest, most destructive of all. But every one can be stopped. With by the raid. The Orkin Man. <laughs> Whichever invader you have. He's is close enough. Technology will destroy them. Then what do you I want an exterminator to come to my house dressed like this. <laughs> Guaranteed. Call the exterminator. I don't know. Have you seen Over the Hedge? <laughs> the Orkin Terminator. That's oh, Orkinator. Yeah, the Orkinator. <laughs> that sounds like a guy who kills orcs. Oh, <laughs> um, that's right. 90s. 90s. <laughs> oh boy. Call the exterminator. Yeah, the 90s were all about gross ass and jump scares, like for Black Angus and the yep. Twin Towers. <laughs> Yeah, just like, wow. Wow. Yeah, kids these days don't know. They don't know and they won't know. <laughs> ah! Woo! <laughs> oh no! Hey, we need a whole Doctor Who episode. <laughs> the exactly Statue of Liberty is about to break it down! <laughs> what? Okay, what? um. Uh, uh. What about all the people that were. <laughs> okay. Bitch, you can't even fit in one of those. Oh, wait. Oh, Duck is in VC. Uh. Oh, hold on, Duck. I'll let you in. <laughs> Bitch, you can't even fit in what that. The, what I the duck. hell is going on in there? The Statue of Liberty. <laughs> there is one Jesus Christ. <laughs> I hate this. Uh -oh. Yeah, they made a whole Doctor Who episode about this. Me looking at my, oh my toy God. models that I collected over the years. <laughs> me with my hobbies. Honestly, <laughs> me when I'm trying to get good references and I have the figures on hand. <laughs> that was... Wow. <laughs> oh look, it's the Olympics. <laughs> the fuck was that jump? <laughs> Is that really how they jump off? Yeah, it's actually. Oh. Not too... <laughs> Use the force. <laughs> Graphic design is my passion. <laughs> What is this a commercial it going? for? Oh, is this for tea? <laughs> the, oh, for, for sure. the National oh, Federation of Federation Coffee of Growers coffee of Colombia. <laughs> That's right, it's fucking coffee. Okay, oh, so right. all these commercials <laughs> are from. <laughs> I love this. The horse is here. <laughs> <laughs> all these commercials. Can you are tell from I am Colombian? They are from '96, so this is a. These things wow. are 28-year-old commercials. Wow. Oh, they're just a year younger than I am. I don't like that. <laughs> also, <laughs> either this is actually a Colombian guy, or it does what most American ads do and get an Italian man to be this. Never forget yeah, the wait, sad crying wait. Native American Dang, that was played by, by a very tan Italian. <laughs> I'm gonna care about on for a second. Jesus, I forgot I'm realistic fish head on my end. <laughs> Is 7-Up still in business? Uh, yes. I only see Sprite. No, 7-Up's still in business. Good. I but it is, but it is true. I don't see it. I don't see it as, as an as much as like. I don't especially think it's when like, you see it. I don't think Starry it's like, now. Yeah, I don't think it's I in like, like up. fast food places. I think it's just like you buy yeah. it at the grocery store. Big offices. Big offices. Big Yummy off. ice cream. <laughs> I long to be a fish. Oh, <laughs> that shot. Oh, what was that shot? That was, that was. Oh, like, what was oh, that oh, shot? Oh, oh. <laughs> was she that topless? Was, oh. What happened to the days when the horny commercials were for women too? Come on. Okay, but we need to go back to this. We need to go back to this. <laughs> oh, okay, she's got a shirt on. She's got a shirt, but it was very shirt on. She's got a shirt on. Okay. Yeah. What happened to like the female gaze commercials? We need more of this shit. Come on. <laughs> what are these little oh, Sears. Oh, oh, Sears. No. Jesus. <gasps> Who is this green M and M? It's yellow M and M, but green. <laughs> bro, bro had a yeah. green goblin arg. Is, yes, their Easter arc. Who's the celebrity they're talking to? I don't that, know. That looks like Willy Wonka's actor. It's not Gene Wilder. <laughs> it's not Gene Wilder. Or, or unless you're thinking of the current Wonka, which it isn't. But that is it's not, not Timothy, Timothy Shalom. No, I know. I, I meant Gene Wilder. Timothy oh. Shalom <laughs> was but a twinkle in his dad's balls Wait, at the time. Is that Rob Schneider? <laughs> <laughs> no. Are you insane? I believe in talking candy, don't I? Oh, good
No, no, no. That's who are you? <laughs> who are you, Let's you see. strange man? Where are you from? Hold on. Hold on. I'll look it up. Yeah, just look yeah. up Easter M&M commercial 1996. Mm -hmm. Yeah, see, and, and it is red and yellow M&M's just painted pastel. Wonderful. Is like this the cowboy again? With Bart. Or with a little imagination. Okay, it's yeah, not. It's just for Worcestershire sauce. It's Worcestershire sauce. My grandmother taught me Chinese cooking. Now you can cook Chinese with oh. Libby's Asian favorite dinner kits. Mm. All the unique ingredients you need to turn your fresh meat and vegetables into a deliciously authentic Asian meal. Libby's Asian. Okay, meat. this is better than the craft cheese ads that I kept seeing, where they kept calling it Oriental. So this mm. is an upgrade. Oh, yeah. How many Wendy's commercials are in this? <laughs> I mean, at least Wendy's at least, had it. At least they, Dave they Thomas were big in the nineties. So. <laughs> oh, sorry if you hear other stuff in the background. My sister's having a sleepover right now. It's okay. Oh, Ellen! Jesus! Jesus Christ! No, no, no. I mean, if it was middle school, I would relate. The faculty. Oh God. I cannot find any fucking this information mystery, on that commercial. Man. He's the man of people's dreams. Who one are video these that's just the commercial? History will, tell, history will say they were buddies. Second Noah? Second Noah? No context, okay! Are they flying in a second flood? Damn. Yay, home improvement. Oh, hi. Oh, oh hi, Buzz Lightyear. <laughs> <laughs> that cut. That just... <laughs> That's a hi, how are you moment. I just had to see that because I thought that said Taco Bell with Dana Carvey. No, I heard Taco Bell too. The Taco, Taco Bell, Bell Dana Carvey Taco show. Bell, Dana Carvey show. Hello, I'm Dana Carvey. Watch my show on Tuesday <laughs> right after Home Improvement. The Taco Bell Dana Carvey show, yeah, but, all new Tuesday. Why is it? I'm gonna go to Taco Bell tomorrow. I'm gonna ask for the David Carvey <laughs> special. Exceptional is too much oh. to ask for. After all, you silly goose! You can't I make a car out of a rock, you you fucking idiot! <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's 39% like is... done with the car. <laughs> I feel like this is the most impractical way to do the math. No. <laughs> Actually, we meant to put 3.5% APR. Right, it's really hard to find any information. Yeah. You know what? Do you want to know why it's hard to find information on that commercial? Why? Why? It's the same year that the They Do Exist commercial came out. Oh no! Oh, no. oh so, wow. Lost it's, media. Oh, it's literally. Uh, what are these? What are these two people about to do? I see in the family. That's guy. not gonna work, is it? It did. I'm terrible. That is some sorcery. I remember the the family. Nineteen ninety six is also when they introduced blue. Apparently, I Jesus. I I remember when they did the Family Guy parody of this, which was they gave the girl the ring and you could see her going down. <laughs> and, and, and like the tagline was like you know you get her a diamond she'll do anything i didn't even know that was a parody of that <laughs> the only one i know is the, it, can it, you pass the jelly that's the one i know or the freaking <laughs> dot some of you family guy fans are the 40 okay this is gonna be an ad for wendy's i could tell does it hurt what they give you Extra strength. Oh. Yeah. oh. Here, That's all my health insurance could cover with some Tylenol. Yeah. Let's go home. More than it was gonna cost three hundred dollars without it. It's Stephen Weber. Oh. You're sure you're Interesting. Fine. I'm Oops. guessing. But I mean, hold on. Here. Six, six, <laughs> oh my <God. laughs> Michael Bay. <laughs> Video editing is my passion. <laughs> Why was Madonna here? Madonza! What did Madonza? Lizard! Lizard! So much happened 
in those like four seconds. Fucking lizard woman. What, what, what was the budget for this commercial? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Total luxury. Price like a base Ultima. Best basic warranty in its class. I could make this in freaking video leap in 10 minutes. Is that Jane Avery <laughs> doing the fucking voiceover? What? 626 zero down, 209 a month. And my we'll, brain when I'm driving we'll my car to work. And we'll get those Ninja Turtles. <laughs> <laughs> 626. Man, she's singing about Mazdas like she owes rent. <laughs> Value is more than just a great price. It's everything. There's a sale at Penny's. You are to us. We're doing more brands. Doing what's real. <laughs> We're doing yeah, more we need brands. brands. We, we need more jingles. We're guys. charging you more. <laughs> am I right? Your purchase. Imagine that one kid's like, there I am, mommy, there I am. <laughs> I'm just like little Jimmy here. Oh, I hate these people. I'm gonna spit in all their coffees. <laughs> and so is that girl. <laughs> She's like, you didn't see anything. Oh, that was Tony J narrating the Mazda commercial? That's Oh my god. Are you Raymond Murdoch? A brother. Oh lord. I thought they said Murdoch like James you know. Earl Jones. About relating to each other. Yeah, I might as well be on Mars. It's just like a TV movie. I, mean, I think it was. Oh yeah. god! <laughs> the fuck is happening in this movie? <laughs> a family. A family. Oh, he's like, yeah. <laughs> Good grief! <laughs> Robert Duvall <laughs> and James Earl Jones. No Jones. That was a very interesting choice of clip to use yeah. for that. Wait, Another uh, interesting clip. Wake up. Trisha, please. <laughs> <laughs> Chrissy, wake up. <laughs> Chrissy, you wake up. You, you got a stream quiet. today. <laughs> Trisha, wake up. <laughs> this is trying to wake me up for awkward cast on Sundays. Why? No, wake what? up. You gotta wake up, What's please. What's the matter? Wake What's up, the please. matter, Trisha? Turn on the TV. <laughs> okay. What a millionaire. <laughs> Six, six, five. You did have to flex by waking them up. Okay, no. Here's one thing. If I won the lottery, mm -hmm. I, I ain't gently, I ain't, gen I ain't gently shaking anyone awake into a pleasant morrow. I'm fucking <laughs> grabbing them and giving them shaken baby syndrome at the age of forty-five. Cause I'm gonna, <laughs> cause I'm gonna be like, wake the fuck up. We gotta move, bro. <laughs> Aeon, Aeon, Aeon. I got to finally my... afford to live in California. <laughs> Bruh, if I freaking had that, I would just go on and and just record myself giving the middle finger to everybody saying, fuck you, I'm rich. <laughs> just five seconds, that's it. <laughs> also, that's what I used the million on. Also, can someone look up 5.5 5 million in 1996 money to 2023 are... money? That's gonna right. be absurd moolah. <laughs> okay, on second thought, we don't need as many jingles as this. Alright, let me see. <laughs> what a count! What an ominous fucking Wait, story. how much? 5.5 million 1996 money to, uh... To 2024 to, money. 2024 12, mil 12 million. Jesus Ooh. Christ. But... <laughs> Actually, wait, I'm wrong. I put five it's million. million the, who's next? Like, where's the crosshairs? Forty-seven cents. <laughs> also, we know these commercials are from California because it's the Californian Lotto. Mm -hmm. But just who's next? I remember that. Logo. Mr. B Mr. Beast origin story. Millionaires <laughs> paid over twenty years. I mean, that's not, I mean, like technically, you can get Lotto in a lump sum and not an installment plan. I think it's. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think. I think it's just you have to pay more in the initial tax. Yeah. Something like that. I don't know. Like, chat, you could say what you would do if you won the lotto. I feel like I would get the lump. Yeah. Mostly because mm -hmm. I would want to put it into savings because the interest on that would be fucking wild. Mm-hmm. Fortnite V-Buck. skin. <laughs> 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 Thank you. Th All th the skins. Th thank you, our token Gen Z uh, person in this call. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I'm the youngest. <laughs> what? Wait, 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 wait. He is shaken to death. Hold up. Oh my god. You oh cannot god. tell me <laughs> right oh, after I am... we talk about <laughs> next. I will say I am an adult now, I'm 21, so yippee. A three month old Who's baby is next? Death. The story of the <laughs> Right is after story. literally right after you joke about shaking face. <laughs> <laughs> A woman is shaking the death. We can even pinpoint <laughs> what part of California these commercials are from because that's San Francisco, Oakland, San Jose, so it's the Bay Area. I don't. Oh, we're on I to, don't. We're on. We're onto you, compilation maker. We're <laughs> I, I don't like how he's like, staring at us like that. Maybe that was me. That this was reminds me of the time, and I don't know if it was on stream or in a call. I was watching a commercial thing, and like apparently the co the set that they took commercials from was the day before the challenger launched so there was a news thing being like oh, no. tomorrow the challenger does its first maiden voyage more at 11. Oh, no. i'm like oh, Oof. No. i'm like oh never wait wasn't big bird supposed to be on the challenger Why yes big bird was supposed to be on the challenger oh, what's on my friend oh, wow those frosted flakes have added salt salt and frosting those are yeah the tiger pizza. lies to you those aren't made with the original <laughs> wheat. <laughs> Good question. Only Nabisco Frosted Wheat Bites has the crunchy goodness of the original. Not wheat. sure. The, the, the Oreo <laughs> brand? But, with brown sugar inside. Heard but funny tiger well, and beef. I haven't beef. seen the <laughs> anymore, so... <laughs> <laughs> You're also lying. I'm kid eating. <laughs> it's the, no, it's the double fisting inside. spoons for me. Uh, that's what I was looking no. at. <laughs> <laughs> like here's the thing i am scared here's here's the thing this is 96. Oh, hi colonel this is 96 right yeah what yeah what year did the juice go loose with his bronco ride 93 like, right okay okay so good we are proceeding the, we are after the events because i was scared to look up some 90s commercials because i know algorithmically some <laughs> compilations would probably have been like 90 or 91 and oh, we would have gotten oh. the juice oh, yeah. he's dead. Familiar, but have you brought home the new menu for oh i it took me a second this to think who you're talking about you're talking about mr orange justice got it yes well orange there was no justice <laughs> <laughs> i mean he's dead right i guess that is the biggest justice of all yeah <laughs> Is that Yay. a chauffeur, chauffeur? No, it's a yeah, chauffeur. It's even worse. It's a chauffeur. Oh, it's a chauffeur. <laughs> Get your mind out of the gutter. Do they still make Lincolns? I don't know. I've driven some Lincolns. Oh yeah, no, they make them. Encouraging some people. As somebody who did valet within the last five years, yes, they still make Lincolns. Quite as much. Lincoln, a luxury car. Did you just die? <laughs> <laughs> But science painfully is dry for healing moisture and the restoring power of vitamins do you feel fucking vitamins. old so <laughs> do you want to feel That's insecure so about your hands all over your hands yeah do you want to hit do you want to feel they insecure about your hands because you have old lady hands and and us men because you know that that's who you are thinking about all the time we look at those hands and if they are wrinkly we our our peepees go soft we want to see the hands and go woo go woo go woo <laughs> you know what my favorite part is is when they have somebody who very clearly has no problems with their skin on something be like hey do you have dry skin not like me i have perfect skin uh, also, Storm so. Shield had a question for you, Lau. Um, mm -hmm. For Abby, looking to get a commission, but I need to know how comfortable are you drawing people, non anthro waist up, holding a Colt gun? What is a Colt gun? What the heck is a Colt gun? What the heck is a Colt gun? <laughs> I'm like, I can, but I just want to. Uh... It's like, yeah, I mean, she does great with people. Oh, I mean, I've drawn Luke one. It's just a pistol, yeah. yeah. Yeah, no, uh, that, I mean, I'm, oh, I'm oh, it'll be it'll third, be less so it'll I'm, be less detailed than probably. I'm raising this my is probably hand. what they're looking for, like a classic. I'm raising yeah, my hand. hand. Yeah, it, I guess. Yes, it, yeah, it would also be which scared. I thought she oh. said Colt with a U. That's what I thought. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm scared of what <laughs> I happened. Don't to, see the chat. I'm scared of what the would Colt, happen if Colt Bun of the Lamb. Chrissy, if anything, okay, it was just up. That that was one frame.
But okay, cult gun is a semi-automatic pistol. Yeah, it should be fine. I mean, uh, yeah. I mean, store, again, I've just grown put, up on the put, third characters, which all wield guns. Yeah, so. we're not we're <laughs> yeah. not afraid of guns as long yeah. as we're not drawing someone shooting someone. As long as the gun is just being it being Rudy and Tootie being and not Shooty, then we're good. Shooty. Yeah. <laughs> that before the panda, she was Lupin. But yes, uh, but yes, Storm. So just include a gun reference when you uh, commission her, and we'll be all good. Formula with three extraordinary ingredients. But yes, I agree with you, Lord. It's like, man, these people have never had a bad skin day in their life. As someone who abuses, uh, whatchamacallit, hand sanitizer, I definitely would need this. Next. It's an all-new episode. Oh, look, gun! Excellent. The best new crime series. I thought the show was- guns? I thought the show was called Excellent. <laughs> Excellent! <laughs> Incident. Make your neighborhood watch next. Okay. Make your neighborhood watch. Force them. <laughs> Do it. Uh, Watched by more Northern Californians. Channel I thought that was Clark Kent. <laughs> I thought that was Clark Kent too. <laughs> because someday you'll get that big promotion that moves you to Seattle. <laughs> <laughs> Seattle? No. <laughs> I don't want to go to Seattle. Someday, Seattle? No, no, um, unless, <laughs> unless it's to work with Fraser Crane, forget it. I was about to say, you know, one day you'll get that big promotion that moves you to Seattle and you work on a radio show uh, that's giving advice <laughs> and your dad Toss is a, salads <laughs> and scrambled, scrambled eggs. eggs. Listen, I would Mercy. only go, someday the only reason to go to Seattle, number one, meet me in Seattle. <laughs> also, thank you. We I just saw that we... Uh, hey, look. It's an accurate um, video of the weather in Seattle. <gasps> Puppy! Nothing but fucking rain. Puppy! So wherever life takes you, we'll be there. The new I saw lots of puppies that were I love the camera and had to take a moment. Where's the car? Oh, there it is. <laughs> I love how it says, whoever you go in life will be there. All I imagine is like you're on your deathbed and you just see the car right next to you. Of course. <laughs> Also, thank you, Crimson. I saw, that you. You, uh, I saw that you sent money to the... Uh, to the Ko-Fi with the uh with just donating and not the commission. But thank you. Oh I assume that it was Thank you, a, Crimson. I'm uh Crimson, just ask, how much did because if it still fits the 20, then then we could still do the sketch. Yeah. But Prime thank man. you so much. I just saw that it went from 38% to 39. So ep let's get it to 40! Is that Tim Curry? <laughs> No. No. I don't know. I, I every time I see like old comer, I don't know why. Every time I see like long hair and then the beard, I think Tim Curry. Yeah. No. He, but yeah. No. He he didn't look like that then. I was so. thinking of Jeff Bridges. AT and T True Reach Savings. That's your true choice. AT and T. Man, I remember when the, I remember the logo looking like that too. Right now, all these new products are three dollars off. Yum. This music kind of slaps, though. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna lie. It's like, I mean, 90, 90s music for commercials did yeah. slap. Pete, so. please keep playing. I don't want to look this. I don't want to look either. Thank you. Down here. For free? For free? We usually throw on a coat in the winter. Um, what are we advertising? I don't know. Oh, just sure. Miami? <laughs> just going to Miami. Just going to Miami. Pause it, pause it, pause it, pause it. Pause it. <laughs> this is so fucking funny because this year they announced they're like, spring breakers don't fucking come here. Oh, yep. <laughs> really? <laughs> Yeah, yes, it's gotten bad. Any fucking tourists, it's gotten that bad. It's the same reason that like certain parts of like the uh, Geisha district in Kyoto are now off limits to tourists. Mm -hmm. tourists oh, I heard tourists. another. Yeah. I heard another notification sound. Oh, yep. Also, thank you, Crimson. Uh, Crimson did donate the the sketch amount, so that's good. Oh, and they donated okay. an extra five bucks. Oh, that's sweet. Yay. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Right now. Thank you, Quimson. Oh, oh, Wait. Really piling up down here, too. Is this more Miami? It is, for sure. Mm. Yeah. Come to Another Miami. Another Miami commercial. Come to Miami. Stare directly <laughs> not, at the but to Miami not have commercial. Jimmy Buffett there. But, but to not have Jimmy Buffett there on the margarita line? Missed opportunity. Damn, Missed these opportunity. subliminal messages are making me want to go to Miami. Man, I'm just 
wonderful. Anybody else getting the vibe they want to go to Miami? I just want to waste away in in Margaritaville. Hey, you must be <laughs> yeah, now no, in Miami. Oh, hey, they're back. It's, Ken, it's the same guy. <laughs> Steven Weber, why did you hang out with the M and M so much? I'm dizzy. The new blue M and M's, except no. I told you earlier that this was the year that they. Was that when John Goodman played the yellow M and M? Who is that? That sounds. That sounds like John Goodman. That sounds like. That was who voiced him. I was right. Okay. So it was before, because Brad Garrett voices him now, right? Yes. No, J.K. Simmons. Oh, it's J. Wait, really? Wait, I thought J.K. did yellow. Yeah, we're talking about Yeah, that's yellow. what I mean. J.K. Simmons plays yellow. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. I knew that. I thought you meant blue for a second. I'm like, huh? Yeah, I don't know who oh, plays no. blue. Uh, it's Flyers. Blue's always kind of... Because he doesn't awesome. speak often. Yeah. So you don't hear... I know green yeah. is... Uh, what's Cree her name? Summer. Cree Summers. Yes. Yeah, and then Cree red's Summer. Frank. Not Frank. Red Billy. is... Billy West. Yeah, Billy. Yeah, Billy West. Uh, I don't know why I said Frank Welker for a sec. <laughs> Dinosaurs! <laughs> Dinosaur. Nothing says the 90s like Dinosaur. I mean, though, truly. <laughs> Dinoco. Putting your very own logo on a t shirt. So it's not business as usual. Alright, let's see what it says on there. Dinosaurs are around a Why do they live in like the Homeward Bound Night house? What can you do? <laughs> the fact that people could afford those kinds of houses? Yeah. So you need to trust them to the right person. 35 years ago. Actually, I've got 2020, thank you. Stop reminding me I need to go to the optometrist. Next to Pearl Vision, you won't see me, Dr. Stanley Pearl. I'd even trust my own eyes too. Nobody cares for eyes more than Pearl. Nobody cares. <laughs> Nobody cares about you except us. But that's just what the Walkers got when they sold their house with our ERA office. The ERA seller security plan. Why did that guy for a split second look like Jean-Luc Picard in that one episode? to take the risk of selling the house at a loss. When we sold it for more, the Walkers got the profit. They used the extra money to take a vacation. The ERA sellers Yeah, we saw that earlier in the commercial, lady. <laughs> there we go. I'm just going to move my laptop to my bed so you don't hear them too much. That's fine. Oh, that's my favorite. Snackles Devil's Food Cookies. Oh, but you can't get those devil facts. Why did that look photoshopped in? Who says that? Really who says those are favorite three? Really? Reduced calorie. <laughs> they were just green screen. Reduced calorie. Just one calorie. Oh. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> go back, go back, go back. To when the screen turned black. Okay. Just watch in the bottom left corner. <laughs> you see it, right? Yeah, I, I saw it. it. I saw the woman. <laughs> also, thank you, Storm. I'm yeah, guessing yeah, that Yeah, thank you. you. I just got that notification. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Hell yeah! It's weird seeing um, the d the notifications for your thing because it's not set like mine. Because I set the custom message that when someone gives me money on Kofi, to this person is canceled. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's classic. Ah, uh, it's classic. Ah. Uh, These eyes have seen styles come and go. These eyes have seen shit. <laughs> They've seen thousands. These eyes have seen <laughs> death beyond your comprehension. But hooray, we hit 40% of the goal. Let's get to 50. Yo, let's go. They've seen Pearl Vision change the way America sees. It just, he just okay, starts seeing fire. Oh, it's shit. the same guy again. It's the same guy again. Oh. What do you think the direction was for the commercial? They were like, okay, Stan, stare. Glasses. <laughs> I, and the reason oh, hi, he glasses. probably said freaking like, okay, just imagine the happiest thing ever <laughs> and just stare. Yes. Where did this come from? Oh, that's the Carter Sense newsletter. It's free with my Carter some CD prescription. It goes with all those pamphlets of retirement really homes yeah. that I've been putting <laughs> in your bedside table. And eating <laughs> <laughs> Ask your doctor about Cardism CD and the Cardisense newsletter and call 1 800 664 0800 for one free copy of Cardisense. I had drip though. The guy has drip. They tried to. And Cardisense. <laughs> oh, I want to freaking be hey, with my feet, feet, feet off the rail. <laughs> the woman who makes you feel lucky to be alive. Yahtzee. <laughs> a tulip means luck. 
Like, how do I tell her? I trust her. I feel like I shouldn't be watching this. Means trust. There are no words. Yeah, I feel like I shouldn't be watching this either. This is someone's like if you can't find the words, four year anniversary. I need to not be here. In the language of the heart, <gasps> see your local Whoa! Why is the gold bond guy here? Like it's a little spicy for an FTD commercial. <laughs> Hi, Fran. Free. Oh my god, okay. Fran oh, Drescher jump scare. Those who play more than I remember these cars. <laughs> They used to be oh, these, are these? Is this the Mazda <laughs> thing again? Oh my god! Lease one from two ninety nine a month, fifteen hundred down. MPV. Mazda. Beautiful. When you register for baby gifts with Target's Lullaby Club, you scan ew. what you like. Children. So will know exactly oh my what you ew, like. kids. You everything you want, except sleep. This place ew. is a toy desert. Let's start wailing. Me and the boys doing our Waluigi impressions at 3 a.m. <laughs> okay, guys, group cry. Wah! 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 I got it. Okay, someone reminded me that the next MomoCon I go to, I just, I, at one of the DA panels, I need to be like, okay, look, this is for, this is for a thing. I need everyone to just go, <laughs> wah, just wah, to, like, wah, like, like, like synchronized baby crying. <laughs> if Chris ever complains, just play that as a sound effect. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh. Because NBC's Ooh. got the sexiest stars of daytime live at the Soap Opera Awards. Find out who you chose. The Soap Opera Remember those? What? <laughs> wow. Now there's only like two so soap operas on TV now. Hottest romance. What the hell? This is the MTV Awards for wine moms. Like. <laughs> yep. Speaking of MTV Awards, man, when Yoda came up there and just said, you homies are awesome or some shit. Yeah. <laughs> homies awesome you are. <laughs> homies awesome you are. <laughs> okay, what are you advertising? Probably a microwave dinner. <laughs> microwave. It is a microwave dinner. Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Wow. <laughs> Oh god! Why are they showing us cup cow noodles while playing a French song? You you know it doesn't look that good from the commercial. Doesn't matter what fine china you put it on. Stay on lip color that helps lips feel moisturized, not dry. But yeah, no. Pause for a moment. You're right, Spade. They were advertising a they were advertising a pasta dish, and it was but they were playing a French song. Yeah. Like, sure, yeah, when I think of Kung Pao noodles, Close I think enough, of right? Mamma Mia. <laughs> Just like true love. Color endures. <laughs> color endures, stay on lip color. Mamma Mia, yeah. I love my baguette. <laughs> Just because other cleaners are blue like Windex doesn't mean they can clean glass like Windex. Windex Watch, you stupid child. Yeah. <laughs> and then a bird flies right into it and dies immediately. Windex, best on glass. What? Oh, the plant. Well, it's because it wants to adjust to the light. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. You okay? I could use some Tylenol. Yeah. Oh, I Another Tylenol commercial. Really? My husband had an ulcer. I got. I should be careful. And let's see. Push it off. They also say you, if you add just a little bit of arsenic to his morning coffee four times a week, you know he'll be gone in the next month. <laughs> <laughs> He'll be gone before but you, you know. didn't hear it from me. You didn't hear it from me, you know. And it's not like I did it before. Stan's not doing <laughs> it's so. Not like I have experience way. on the matter. Yeah, yeah it just works great. If you're using I'm gonna open, send you, you more in the you. most Talk delightful little video I've ever seen. You're still giving me the answer. Are you ever gonna listen? You're in a restaurant. No. This is your choice. Uh, it's the Activia lady. <laughs> Why she stands at dead ass sounds like a fucking sexy like. Yeah, he fucking sounds like sexy. You're now living best life, holy shit. She tried. She tried to be fucking Yoda. Wedding dance, and we've been dancing ever since. This year, Tide celebrates its 50th anniversary. We're gonna drink some Tide. Like the Peters. Ah, yes, my favorite challenge of 2016. 
lots of good clean dirt. Sometimes my Actually, that would have the Tide Pod Challenge was 2018. It was 2018. Jesus. Mhm. Mm Damn, my dates are all mixed up. I was thinking 2016 because of when they got Jasper's VA. The freaking deal Tide Pod Challenge is a joke. The baptism outfits and watched many times. Oh. <laughs> 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 Look at the demon <laughs> child. <terrified. laughs> it's gotta be clean. It's gotta be tied. It's not unusual. On wings, joins the Mile High Club. Well, I just saw somebody describe a uh, fully grown koi fish as an uppercase goldfish. <laughs> I mean, are they wrong? <laughs> They're not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> They're not wrong. They're not wrong. <laughs> Proceeds to have screaming. Color safe bleaching action all whitens without bleach. Let those kids do what they're gonna do. You got a l l look. No, I'm not gonna have to confiscate this for a child. Ice cream. I wish they, I, I wish stains came out that easily. This I just like I, I kids wish so. do what they're gonna do, and I'm like, no, no. I just had to deal with two kids knocking shit over because they kept throwing a frisbee back and forth in the store, and I had to basically kindly scold them by grabbing the frisbee when it was closer to me and being like, I'm taking this now. This looks like I feel that I that happened. That happened at my work. Someone had to steal freaking silly string from a kid because they were kept using it. Oh, and just gave him the meanest Luigi stare. This looks like what happens when like uh, like national alert system things happen in the middle of TV shows. <laughs> oh my it's god! Like, it's it's like the SpongeBob. He's like, it's not the end of it. Yes, it is. And then accused the test warning. The appearance of wrinkles. What wrinkles? How many wrinkle commercials have we gone? Two? Three? Two. And one for hands and now one for feet. Eat good. Eat good. Feel good. Feel good. Feel life. Is that an Feel bad. Play <laughs> Watchers again? Ew. Yeah, it's the they dominated the 90s. It's the 90s. They really did. Yeah. Shelly? Guess who? We need some medicine for that cold. It's Diamond Tap Elixir. And it's your favorite flavor. Oh, 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 I can't even look at it. No, no, it's no, vitamin no, Benjamin. Not the purple. When that commercial is over. It's lean flavored. <laughs> Fresh blades! No, 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 real talk. I actually have a fight or flight response to liquid medicine. Because whenever I got sick, that's what I would have. And it was literally so disgusting. I would literally have major meltdowns whenever I got sick. Because I knew mom was going to bust out the liquid medicine. I... I I can I understand that. Wait, 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 pause, 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 because we're talking over these commercials here. Oh, sorry. Uh, <laughs> I can't even sorry. think about liquid medicine that much anymore because I get the taste on my tongue and then I start, like, actually freaking out. I, I can understand it. that. I can understand I that. that. And I'm sure Uncle Phil can understand that, too. He's a perfect mess. Never mind that. Take off the cuffs. One kiss. I'm gonna have to chew my arm off. In the house at first prince and begin Monday. Cartoony chewing noises. She's alive. I will. He thought she was dead, but not uh back and reclaim her if she survives days of our lives. Sister returns in a moment on NBC. That's a baby. Oh, that's what we were watching? Oh god! Oh that just gave me whiplash. Look, Joe, it wasn't an insult. Wasn't an insult, Bobby. Did he insult me? Oh, hi, Alec Baldwin. Oh, hi. Uh, <laughs> oh, hi, boss baby. <laughs> boss baby. Boss was that baby. LL Cool? Oh, John Candy. Oh. That's Wait, no. That? <laughs> oh, no, Coolio. Oh, that was Coolio. Again, I'm the millennial in here. I don't know too many actors. <laughs> <laughs> hey, look, Joe, it wasn't an insult. Oh, that's I mean, not I, the I, Tyson. To, I don't know why I thought that. I'm trying to think of who was the cast of Fast Saturday Night Live in 1996. Well, I mean, David yeah, David Spade, for one. Uh, Chris Farley. And, and uh, by the way, that's, yeah, Chris Farley there. But, yeah, so, that's what it was. It was Chris Farley. Was he supposed to play Shrek? He was, originally, yeah. And then when he passed, they... They got did. Mike Myers yeah, in there. Mike. And then they redid the entire thing because he threw in the Scottish accent and they're like, 
I guess we're working with this now. So. Yeah. Good evening, everyone. I'm Catherine Heenan. Coming up on Nightbeat, if you were stuck in slow-moving traffic on the Bay Bridge last week, well, brace yourself because there will be another round of overnight delays. In the northwest, oh, gosh, everybody brace yourself. Oh, God, that is a big flood. And it's even worse than expected. Oh, boy. And how many times do we hear the same common-sense advice to living a healthier life? Well, apparently a lot of us just start listening. Taking the first step to living better. We'll have those stories coming up at a Shut up. Shut up. Shut up, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> -uh. -uh. Live your best life. Shut the oh, fuck man. up. Oh, man. See, this is the Regis and... I grew up with Regis and Kathy Lee. That yeah. was... Like, I was a little girl. No, wait. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. What call in it, the Sam it. Hill? What is it? What the scallop? <laughs> call an ambulance, okay, yes, but I not was, for I me. Was for me. <laughs> Who's? Is that Alan? Are you okay? Is that what you feel? So funny, just him coming Wait, up. Is that Ray Liotta? Let, well, what we'll, prob we'll probably, we'll probably, realize we'll that probably really. see a little thing with the movie? actors' names at the end. Yeah, like it looked. Yeah, that's him. I'm about to go and yeah, get I was you right. just <laughs> right, really, uh... I'm gonna get sued by bees. <laughs> I'm get... Ray Liotta's private cell. Back. I'm gonna strangle B Jerry Seinfeld. So this is Give your moment. Christopher McDonald. Yeah. Damn. I don't know half these people. I'm using Pam, the only leading all natural cooking spray to cook a low fat feast. Pam all natural, natural processed ingredients. So nothing comes between you and the taste of your food. Yeah, all natural. <laughs> all all natural in an aerosol no. can. No. A runny nose, a sore throat. No. No. Then why get her medicine for symptoms she doesn't have? <laughs> yeah, <babe. laughs> Well, then this was a waste of time. Thanks. That was the most <laughs> passive aggressive thing ever. Oh, After that, I want a divorce. <laughs> Try and make the specialized formulas so you can relieve just the symptoms they have. This is what she needs. I know. I was just testing you. Oh. <laughs> Try it. I know. Kim Cattrall was in that unforgettable movie. Good idea. Until you put it on. You take my nerves and you rattle my brain. Now the latest from Maybelline, new Great Lip. The first great lip. Butch proof lipstick. You know, the sequel to our It's Okay Lip. Great on. <laughs> New drinking and game. Every time, so every time we get a, well, every time we get a beauty product, you take Whoa. a shot. Oh no, no, no! I'd be dead. I know. That's what I would be right now. Did you pack my Sensodyne? We're on vacation. No. My sensitive teeth aren't. My dentist <laughs> don't. <laughs> I have special teeth. I mean, okay. I, I feel it. I feel that. Also, wow, what an what a I like how her excuses were on vacation. We're on like, vacation. Oh, well, my, my mistake, teeth are not. Course, my teeth, my teeth can t easily take a vacation. <laughs> oh, Strumpet, how you doing? I know Strumpet. He's a uh, he's really cool. Oh Aww. man, but like. Also, how passive aggressive to have sensitive teeth thing right next to probably sugary iced tea with well, a lot of know. ice cubes it, in it. I I don't think it's so much sugar as it would be just very highly acidic tea. Or cold. <laughs> also, when you're when yeah. you have sensitive teeth, have you ever had anything when you got sensitive teeth that's like got ice in it because mm -hmm. the cold? <laughs> oh, need an oxygen sensor. Duh. <laughs> would be a Twitter reaction. That's a Twitter reaction video. It does. It does. It does. Why does your automobile need an oxygen sensor? It does. <laughs> it's a mouth open. Oh. <laughs> that dude literally looks like he was put on the spot. Like yeah. Today. The O'Neills need an advantage to sell their house fast. I'm Wendy Hutchings, their ERA associate, and I have the answer. ERA's Electronic Home Selling Network. 
a revolutionary new system that shows their oh, home god, to that computer. Buyers, computer. Well as computer. Computer. Back when people had their towers like yeah. under their mm -hmm. their screens. ERA is the electronic realty advantage. Call one eight hundred five one eight seven. Kind of wish I grew up with that type of computer. Would have been funny having that. To accomplish everything you need to do on the ground, often you have to spend time in the sky. Now, do, what you do get it? Is a skyscraper? Credit card. American Express, giving you American <sighs> Express service on the ground and Delta Airlines service in the sky. You can apply yeah, now. In the, the <laughs> was actually a luxury. In the Mile High Club. And not so, shit, yeah. Every dollar you spend earns you a Delta I'm sorry. Hey, remember the days when flying was actually fun? You earn. Yeah. I, I... Now sorry. I can't get a plane off the fucking ground without an engine falling off. Mm-hmm. Charging you two bucks for a cup of, like, lukewarm water. <laughs> Let me fly in peace while children screaming. Man, y'all are fun at parties. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I was gonna say this is the this shows our mindsets being different. I was gonna say that the Delta Airline things reminds me of the pudding guy. You know the guy oh, who Oh yeah, the, the guy who ate so guy. much pudding that he saved so much freaking money to get free flights, right? Yes, oh, yes. Yeah. Cause he kept cause he kept oh. buying like the cause they all had like those um UPC codes that could get you airline miles during a promotion and he just bought like four thousand dollars worth of pudding and that gave him like two <laughs> million airline miles for Delta. <laughs> Even faster. You get one and a half sky Honestly, miles that Can I get some pudding? Plus, I, yeah, I just want to know if he ate the footage. Yes. Sky miles automatically with the card. And when you apply now, you'll benefit from this low introductory rate. Call 1-800-SKY-MILE and apply now. We can take all the information in just a few minutes. Call we can take all, tell all us about how much pudding you bought. Sky miles credit card. The sooner you can get someplace, you really want to go. We'll take all your information. How do you like having a credit score? Hello, Gary. <laughs> Dad, uh, what's new on the aircraft financing? Good news. Yeah? Matter of fact, I just heard from First Union. Oh, that was quick. Yeah, it's a solid proposal. Oh, God. It's coming right towards it's us. It's coming right at us. <laughs> it makes you back to your job. Uh, Gary, let's get them the last now. thing on QC is like, no, but really is actually coming at us. Hey, yo, watch your jet. Watch your jet. Watch your jet. <laughs> Responsive solutions <laughs> first union. His union. I guess I was gonna say, what the last thing a bird sees when it flies into an airplane. <laughs> I was gonna say POV <laughs> the first the B movie. And I'm not alone. They promise big savings over AT and T. They're not comparing similar calling plans. I, I didn't see any big savings. I may look calm, but I'm really irked. Well, that's a story. You really, <laughs> really irked. Man, really this is a irked. really active parking something. garage. Rate gate. We can help you get the facts. I don't like that. Next on Comedy Riot. <laughs> it's an EP. Curious. Out of control. There's just people making funny noises on stage. And I'm sorry, I gotta go back to that last one. <laughs> that wasn't a bit, that was a cry for help. <laughs> now that's improv. <laughs> <Now that's impressive. laughs> you look like the freaking temp doctor for a second. I don't know why. After week for just nineteen ninety eight, save forty dollars off the cover price and get the special cartoon collection free with your paid subscription. Or two. Call one Well, yeah, but they're New Yorker cartoons, so they think they're funny when they're not. Yeah. I'm Jackie Joyner Kersey, and I have asthma. But it hasn't kept me from setting four world records because I control my asthma every day. And even if you think you have because asthma, I'm an airbender, control, you should call the asthma. <laughs> I'm an airbender from Fortnite. They'll send you a free kit full of the latest information to help you understand and manage your asthma better. You'll get lots of useful tools, including a four step program that can help you prevent attacks before they occur. And best of all, four step program for each version of bending. First, you get the asthma gun. This kills the asthma <laughs> how do i stop four four villain toes hit him with the asthma gun <laughs> if you follow the daily treatment plan your doctor prescribes and the asthma control program from glaxo welcome can help so call 1-800-732-3281 right now 
The sooner you get with the program and stick with the program, the sooner you can take control of your asthma. I don't let asthma control my life, and you don't have to it's let It's time it to kick asthma. <laughs> oh, shut up! I thought she said you'd take care of your ass <laughs> instead of asthma. Sometimes we toss and turn for hours. But with select comfort, we go right to sleep. Inside the select we haven't touched each other in 40 years. <laughs> air chambers cradle your entire body. I had terrible back pain. So why? I'm me. sorry. Why does he talk like the voice I put on when I'm making fun of people? Hi, how you doing? <laughs> how are you? I haven't slept in Man, years. Some just sound like that, I guess. Yeah, my name is Vincent. La Wait, his cool. last name is Lapresti. <laughs> for a mattress co that can't be your real name you're not real you're, you're a <laughs> you're a plant from the mattress industry you're from big sofa metal coils comfortable pressure points big bed <laughs> big bed but the select comfort big bang attack okay my friend at the at mattresscompany.org no one is buying a water bed for comfort yeah, you know how much you're sloshing around on one of those? I hard mattress. My husband loves it. I like my nice and soft. With the select comfort, it is what it is. You select your comfort. He doesn't laugh at that. 40 minutes later, she's still going on about it. <laughs> That's why they needed to have the, the, cut, the, the, the absolutely not seamless cut to the next thing. Select comfort is the answer to a better night's sleep. Call now for your free video and brochure and information on our no We also give you a piece of the sky. So you've chosen to be your own <laughs> boss. Running your own business means doing what you love. And doing what you Wearing do vests and ties. And day. going from one desk to the other. The books. <laughs> well, now you can say goodbye to your bookkeeping hassles forever. Because the makers of Why do you sound robot Because it is a robot. Accounting software <gasps> that makes it fast and easy to do the things you... People still use the QuickBooks software, though. Yeah. That's concerning. Well, I mean, obviously it's updated, but I'm saying that it's actually... This is one of the few things that we have watched that actually still kind of exists. Well, no, no. Apparently 7up does still exist. for fast information? A click, and QuickBooks shows you this quarter's income and expenses. Oh, God, that layout. And QuickBooks does your invoicing for you, and then does the bookkeeping automatically. So you can get back to doing what you do best, growing your business. It's even easy to try QuickBooks. Call now to get a trial version for- Why did those hands not look like he is for a second? <laughs> like I said, he's a robot. It's QuickBooks. It does everything for you. That was uh, the end of that conversation. That was it. That, and, and look, and we are now in the drawing hour. Bye-bye. Yeah, so, so we'll, 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 <laughs> we'll call you guys back when we're taking a break from the drawing hour. Okay, bye-bye. Yeah, because we're alternating them. So yes. thank you guys for joining us for this. And then, yeah. Uh, yeah, we'll see you right after the drawing hour. No problem. See you guys in like an hour or so. Yeah, okay. Yep. All right. Who are those weird people that came into All our right. house? I don't know. I don't know. I, had, I, I, I was trying to. I was trying to sell a bit that I knew them. I, uh, I Do you, mean, was I, it convincing? Yeah, I think I bought it. Almost seemed like you were friends with them, especially that, especially that purple one. Oh, I love the purple one. Purple one's it, fun. It, it, is 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 stub purple or punk? Like I, it's like an in between shade for me. Like it almost looks like an ashy purple, or is it like a fleshy pink? Spade, answer me. That I know that you're probably still in the chat, but okay. Now, now we just need to get your screen share on. Yes, it, there it is. Yep. One second. And it should still be like how it was the other day. Oh, so I gotta crop it. Ignore all my. Okay, ignore all that. Ba 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 da da do do you. So we already oh, got and Storm. Some... I wanted to make sure that mm -hmm. I got uh, the note here because I I saw obviously the I saw the donation came through, but I couldn't see what they requested. Also, for some reason, or I think that's the thing with the with the with the commissions. For some reason, I have I can't see when they send in stuff. Only unless they DM me information. Oh, that's weird. That is weird. 
I'm trying to figure out. Look, look I mean, I, like, if maybe you I'm look, I, I, I mean, I know I, I've been able to see references when people send them, like in Kofi. Mm. So that's interesting. Yeah, give me one moment. I'm fixing our PNG tubers. There we go. Now we're visible. Perfect. Uh oh, oh, hold on. Oh, never mind. I had to go to an extra tab here. There we it. go. Uh, we're all good. Character. We're all good. Now I gotta got also it. put yeah, the lo-fi okay. hip hop back on. We gotta low this fi. Are you telling me a lo-fi this bop? <gasps> oh. All right. Yep, everything's all good, guys. Now we're into the drawing hour. Woo woo. And you and y'all could still get I almost said you people. Well, I'll be closing that soon and I'll be opening the prime the, stream the stream one. the stream rate one, yes. Yes. Let me know when you have it open so I could put it in the uh in the chat. Yeah. So good job all you mm -hmm. people who got the discounted rate. You guys are the cool ones. I'll link it to you here. One momento. So that's the current one. So uh, the, the pre-stream sketch link is now closed and it'll be opening up the, you know, during stream. Yes. <laughs> yes, yes, Crimson, you're cool. Yeah, no, don't worry, Storm. I got everything from there. It was because I'm getting used to the, the layout for the commissions. She's set up learning on, on coffee. <laughs> so the messages were going to a different area than I was thinking. And I'm like, oh, okay, never mind. Got them. <laughs> so. Yes. Okay, the description of the stream is updated, and I just put the new one in the chat. Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Crimson. Uh, that's probably actually that's probably the other one. What is for Zatanna? Is there are there multiple versions? I'm not familiar. Yeah, with. Yeah, like do you want the DC Superhero Girls one with the purple hair? Do you want like Justice League animated yeah. series? Yeah, because I was gonna say I'm like I'm familiar with some of them, but not familiar with all of them. So I just want to make sure that I'm if I yeah. have re need to look up references. I get the right one. <laughs> In the meantime, until I get the note of that, uh, I'm going to start on the Fujiko and OC one. Ooh. So that's for Drumming Oni, who yes. wanted to have just uh, Fujiko and and his OC drum hanging out. So uh, we're thinking maybe uh, for a girls' night out, I would think, uh, you know, that maybe them having some drinks or something like that, maybe sitting at a... Sitting at the at the bar or something, having maybe, girl talk. Maybe wasting maybe wasting away in Margaritaville. In Margaritaville. <laughs> Let's see. Justice League sure. animated version says Crimson. Okay. Let me
Good choice, good choice. Fine year, fine year. All right. Let me make sure I have the references up for here. Ignore me moving this canvas around. Ah. I'm still not over the cowboy jump scare at the beginning of the commercials. <laughs> like how cowboy. like how do you direct that? Like how are you like this is good direction for our steakhouse commercial? Cider or umeboshi is what makes drum get drunk. I don't know what umeboshi is. I assume, and forgive me for, for assuming, a drink. <laughs> Ramsey says uh, for Lauren, no drawings for me tonight, but I'd like to thank you for the previous drawings you've done for me. I'm so happy to hear that. Yeah, thank like, you, Ramsey. Your support is wonderful. Ah, Always. So Ume you. Boshi is pickled plums. Ew. Mm. I mean, I'm sure that they taste fine, but there's something about plums where I'm like, I don't know if I want them pickled. Sorry if you hear noises, that's my phone giving me a little notifications. Well, I had it on silent mode, but it keeps going out of silent mode. <laughs> You're so good with just laying down bots. Oh, thank you. <laughs> like you're good. I feel at like I'm so rough with it, but no, you're just so good at very naturalistic posing. Like it, it's the it's interesting a thing. A lot is of that, practice. Yeah, because it's the thing of like some people could really lay down like you know very wacky dynamic poses easily, but when it comes to doing natural stuff like you know a character just standing. Ironically, that's where people struggle a lot because, you know, that is the easiest thing to make look stiff. Yeah. It's like a- it's a weird devil tango. Devil's tango. <laughs> Just to- to quote, uh, Alex Myers. Of course. <laughs> How would you even pickle plums to begin with? Well, you would take the plums, then you pickle them. And you pickle them. Yeah, because keep in mind, I hope people realize that pickle is also a verb. It is not just mm -hmm. the 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 fun the you know the funniest shit you've ever seen. It's also just a verb. <laughs> but yeah, I guess what you would pickle it in, I think, is the. Question. I mean, like I I would assume, I guess, like a. Uh, I guess like a simple brine, you know, like salt water. Maybe, yeah. Because I don't know much about sweet pickling. Like, you know, I know that some pickled ginger is regarded as sweet, but who knows? The simplest something is, the easier it is to screw up. Ah, no truer, truer words have been said, Odie. It's very, yeah. 
It's, it's just like when I think about characters that would be seemingly simple to draw. Like, you could look at something like a, a Peanuts character and it's say, that's easy, I can draw that. And then the moment you get anything even slightly off, it doesn't look right. Well, that's because the, that's the thing. The more simplistic the character, the easier it is for it to look uncanny. Like, you know, not to mention the horse program. But I think that's why, like, the mark, the, those, like, original marketing vectors for, like, the Gen 4 ponies look so weird. Because their mouths mm -hmm. were kind of, like, off. Because they were pointier than, like, uh... Than, you know, than they are in the show. Because they're such simple designs that when you get one aspect wrong, it looks... Re or Powerpuff Girls. Powerpuff Girls is also something where it's, like, it's Powerpuff so Girls, easy to yeah. look freaky deaky. What's a, what's a, what's like a thing that's always like your, you know, you need to practice kind of often. Like it's not, mine is, as much as people make jokes, mine is feet. Feet and shoes. Yeah, that's, I mean, they, they are tough. I think anything involving clothing, like fabric texture. Mm-hmm. Like just in general, fabric texture can be tedious if you don't if you don't warm up on it to start and get your your you know your groove yeah no i no i get you like um you know people people sometimes uh, rag on certain character design and stuff and i'm like you know what no i understand why uh why characters in simpsons and family guy just kind of wear generic round gray shoe because like Shoe, shoes are so hard because you have to do a foot shape, but not really. <laughs> mm-hmm. Like I if you gave if you told me I had to draw like a thousand hands or a thousand feet, I would rather draw a thousand hands. Yeah, oh. meanwhile. I'm yeah. not as big a fan of the hands as I am of, like, in terms of, I think it's because with feet, you can just make a simple triangular shape. Yeah. With hands, it's more finicky. Like, you can't just go, oh, just a glove shape, because then you don't feel satisfied enough with a glove shape. Unless it's the art style that you're going for. Yeah. Uh, meanwhile, I sit here as I say this drawing. <laughs> Like, um, the, you know, there's certain, cer like, I know that if I'm drawing something and hands aren't the main focus, I tend to do my, uh, kind of, uh, I call it, like, the mitten method, where it's, like, you have the index finger and then the, uh, middle ring and pinky are kind of their own thing. And it's just, like, it makes it faster. But, like, mm -hmm. uh, I don't, when it, and this is very ironic, because I'm currently working on a on a giant painting where part of the main focus is a hand cradling a character's face and then I and I'm like I'm proud but also why why did I do this to myself I didn't have to do this this was an active choice that I made <laughs> uh but I like this character is she like an elf? Uh, Oni. She's based off of she's based off of Lum. From... I I didn't want to say because I know some people get really irked if they uh if someone says that their character looks like another character, but I was getting Lum energy from the little horns. Yeah. Hello, Lion Roo. Welcome to the stream, and also to you too, awfully hot coffee pot. Fantastic name. <laughs> yes. I mean, one of my favorite people who come into the chat is uh, Wario dies in a car accident. That's their whole name. Where? <laughs> where? 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 <laughs> that, that's lo that's Waluigi at Wario's funeral. <laughs> where? They call the way ambulance. Yeah, uh, but no, he, he he's really beat up. It, it's not looking good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm trying to think for a cider glass. I guess it would just be like a 
But cider, I, I mean, it would like, just be like I, a pint glass, I would imagine. I think it would be a pint glass, yeah. Like, when I do drink a cider for myself, uh, which is very rare, because I don't usually like the taste of hard cider. There's only one hard cider I like, and I can't get it in America. Uh, it's only a Europe one. It's called Balmer's. And I only like the the berry flavored, which me and Max just called the the red label. It's so good. Ironically, though, uh, they also have a pear flavor, and it is mm. one of the worst things I've ever tasted. <laughs> it's like, how do you make something so good yet you know so much evil? But yeah, usually when I get those, I just drink them out of the bottle. But I know they serve cider in glasses. Mm. Ah, I'm the commission fellow for the Discord, says Lion Roo. Yes, that one, I've actually, I'm very close to finishing it, so you will have it tonight. Awesome, yay! Lion Roo. And with that, and you know Lion Roo. If this one, if that one's going to be finished tonight, you can get a new one. Right meow. Mm -hmm. Nailed it. <laughs> you see, I went meow because l lion. <laughs> you got to know how to work that. Rar. 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 X3. Red label. Well, because it's like a reddish pink label that they have. Because all the different flavors are different labels. Like normal flavor is yellow, uh, pear is green, berry is red. Now you think red would be for the apple because apples are red. Nay, nay. <laughs> Ah, God, now I want to watch the guy. His last name always escapes me. I know it's, is it John Pinay or something like that? The one that goes, nay, nay. <laughs> Chris mm, would know. Good question. I, it's because it, he, he has a whole bit about like going to doing a Europe tour and like the French mm -hmm. hotel people say that they don't understand English, but they're watching CNN in English right behind him. <laughs> He was all. He was also in a production of Hairspray, and come. Yeah, it is John Penney. I am a genius. John Penney, nay, nay, nay. Yes. Or I mean, I don't think it's Panette. Panette, Penney, Panini. <laughs> Panini. He is. He, he is John Panini now. <laughs> John Mulaney. John Panini. Same John, difference. John Camperini. I've been a fan a long time ago. Yeah. Okay, people know who I'm talking about. Yeah. You go now. You eat like free. Really. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Joey says they're still, they're very excited for the Sam and Max doodle. Oh, yeah, that one is also near completion as well. So both of you tonight will be beginning years. After I can't. I, I sure. want to see the Sam and Max one. I'm excited for that one. Yeah, I'm like that one. I'm genuinely was like, I want to make sure this still looks like Sam and Max, but still my style. So yeah. I'm doing my best to honor that. You scare, you scare customer. You eat like free willy. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. It also makes me think of like when they were when he goes to the Dairy Queen because he's he really wants ice cream because it's a hot day in like Arizona or something and there's just one person holding up the whole line. Which mood? I felt that. And it's always Dairy Queen. As someone who lived in a town that was called Two Stoplights and a Dairy Queen, I don't know how a town with <laughs> such a small population always had like super long lines at the Dairy Queen. It's like, is the whole town here that's at where the same was. time? Yep. Oh, yeah. The, to, to give people an insight of how small the town I used to live in was, it was a town event that a subway got put into. Not the train, the sandwich shop. 
the subway got put in and it was like the whole town was there for the ribbon cutting. Like... Subbubby, Ifrif. Yeah, in, in su Suabway. Oh, was it a Coldstone? I thought it was a Dairy Queen in that stand-up routine. I mean, Coldstone also shares the same thing of, there's always one. There's always one who's like, hey, can I get like 50 mix-ins with this? But it also is a like it size, so it's a really small amount of ice cream you're putting the mix-ins into. Coldstone ice cream always fascinates me because I don't- I have a conspiracy theory that it's not actually ice cream. <laughs> what do you think it is? I think it's frozen pudding. <laughs> now, <laughs> stay with me. It's because it's so stretchy. Have you ever had Coldstone and you lift the spoon up over your head and you, you're like, why is it stretching so much? Like, I don't think ice cream is supposed to do that. But you know what does do that? Frozen pudding. How do I know? I have frozen pudding. <laughs> is frozen pudding and uh, frozen custard, like, the same thing? Or similar? Hmm. I mean, I, I feel like definition-wise, Genuine you know, question. <laughs> well, no, that's what I'm thinking, because I think, like, custard uses more egg yolk than pudding. Mmm. But, like, but, yeah, like, uh... I mean, the, the, the actuality answer, the not Chrissy sounding like a fucking crazy person answer is they probably just have a lot of xanthan gum in their ice cream, which is why it's so stretchy. Uh, because yeah, when probably. you put in a lot of stabilizer into a dairy base, it tends to be stretchy. I know that because I watched the Try Guys do it without a recipe about uh, making ice cream. And Keith ruined his ice cream because he put like a quarter cup of xanthan gum in there when you're only supposed to use like half a teaspoon. And when the judges ate it, they were like, it's not melting. And it's also like <laughs> stuck in our mouths. Yes. He essentially made paste. Uh, so I'm like, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I can believe when the whole like uh, sales pitch of your company is watching people beat mixings into an ice cream. Yeah, you would want it to be stretchy. So like, uh, I, they probably just put a lot of xanthan gum in it. However, I like to believe that this is just a psyop of them believe making us believe it's ice cream, when in actuality, it's big pudding, uh, <laughs> trying to offset their- <laughs> Big pudding. Try, trying to uh, <laughs> Your amusement of that broke we'll keep me. going. It's big pudding say, saying, uh, trying to offset- their, their sales losses since the 1970s because people don't use jello or pudding as much as they used to by making it into quote unquote ice cream. Wake up, America! I mean, sounds legit. <laughs> sounds legit for me. Uh, God, I need to make a stream setting on here for when I go on my tirades. Uh, that is just me in front of a, it, like, with a podium. Judge, <laughs> just to rant and rave. Uh, but is in xanthan gum also used in beer? Maybe xanthan gum is used in a lot of things. Makes sense to me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, look, it wouldn't be the first time that a company offsets things. Do you know that the government? Like, has literal bunkers of cheese that they've had since the war. That they that they send to schools all across America for school lunches because they bought too much cheese during the war. Your, your cheese and your grilled cheeses back when you were like in elementary school? From a bunker. Bunker cheese. Bunker cheese. Yeah, that government cheese that everyone talks about, that is all, that is the cheese that is sent to public schools. 
The more you know. The more you know. I'm here to wake people up. I will not send you in a, in a, into a pleasant good night. You are getting a violent good morning. Is it raining where you are? It's pouring over here. Yes. It was like... The, the rain was thundering earlier. I could hear it through my headphones. <laughs> we get... It we've been loud. getting so much rain. We... I think we... Didn't we get more rain than, like... I think we got more rain than... I can't remember if it was, like, Oregon or Seattle. <laughs> just, we've also... Just, I think we've year. gotten more rain the past, like, three months than California usually gets in, like, five years. So, like... Yeah. I mean... The, the what's the California I mean, nothing thing is to worse say? than last year but oh yeah you know <laughs> California thing to say is we needed the rain but you know I don't need the rain because y'all don't know how to drive in the rain they they need I mean, to start doing Californian driver's test with someone holding like a hose up in the air so you guys could simulate rain Uh mm, bunker cheese. That's Matthew. Bunker cheese. I love how you draw Fujiko. Oh, thank you. I'm like she was actually the trickiest one for me to figure out to draw in my style, which I'm hoping Michael you're okay with this is kind of a little more my style. But I'm sure that's I think I like that I'm kind of finding a stated an... Lupin style. Like, if they really wanted it like that, but I just really like how you draw her. Gives me real 80s Fujiko vibes, which I dig. It's the hair. It is the hair. Big hair I equals especially, big fun. I'm especially, yeah. And um, I remember how much, of course, I love, like, part four Fujiko. Mm -hmm. And then part eight Fujiko's hair is also... Or not part eight, but 1980s part three for go. Yes. That's the numbers I was mixing it. Yes, yes. I don't know about a part eight. Um, <laughs> Someday. <laughs> not when we've even gotten a part. Not when we've not even haven't even gotten part seven yet. That that's but that's the that's the yeah. thing. Lo that's the thing, Lois. It's so big it skips seven and eight. <laughs> <laughs> I have spoken. Drumming says, out of all the commissions I've purchased, this is the first time seeing Drum without the disguise. Huh. Yeah, because she, she, I've always drawn Drum in a disguise as Fujiko. Yeah. Which is a trick. It's, it's, it's an absolute trick to achieve that, by the way. Because you have to be like, well, you also have to make it kind of, because they have very similar face shapes. And, and, uh, build. And it's just like, so you have to go, well, what are, what would be little peaking features to kind of differentiate who's who? If you're looking at eyelashes, show, if you're looking at drum. Yeah, it's like, I like her eyes, and she's got to have her ears poking out a little bit. She's got those, you know, the little little, horns, the lump, po pointy, or the horns and the ears. Um, I think a little bit more baby faced. She is a bit more baby faced. But, like, this is like an Elsa and Anna situation. One looks a bit older than the other. This is my caption for the, uh, for the, for the picture. Hey, you want to go steal a boat? It's funny because the other prompt was like if they were gonna possibly go on a heist. So that's actually pretty. <laughs> well, funny this is that that's that what up. you do in Miami, right? I, that's what the commercials told me. You stare at the sun and steal boats. I predicted that maybe twenty twenty four could be part seven. I mean, maybe because last year was part zero, right? Yeah. Well, I, yeah, Lupin Zero, if that's what they considered it. Not, I wouldn't say it's part zero, but yeah, it would be, I guess, kind of Lupin sort of. Lupin Zero. Lupinini. Mm. Mm. Lupino. Yeah, like maybe. Margarita! I was gonna say, should, should it be a margarita? Margarita! <laughs> a big <laughs> mouthful. <laughs> margarita! <laughs> A big drink for big personalities. Mm. 
Lupin one half. No, that implies Lupin gets the ability to turn into a girl, and I don't know if we're prepared for that power. Oh no, Joey, she is a gold digger. Like, uh, that's her whole thing. She's really good in part six, the, the, you know, the second half of part six, the good half of part six. Yeah, the, the, the good half of part six. The not Sherlock Holmes half. Mm-hmm. The one that wasn't wasted potential. Yeah, the one that also that didn't have like a Jesus episode and a train. Choo choo. <laughs> I like the train. Okay, one. but the train episode was actually kind of fun. The yeah. train episode was fun. That could have been in any part. <laughs> I need and like I said here as somebody who knows her audience, I am I am too smart a person to speak on one particular episode. <laughs> so um and I say that because it, it involves a um, something supernatural. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna I'm not gonna talk about that one. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a I'm a smart enough person to to avoid that one right now. <laughs> <laughs> Is it the episode with the dinosaur? Yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It's a like, that one's again, a, it's, it's a weird it's a weird episode. I like it because it's it, weird. It, I fully understand why people don't like it. <laughs> yeah, I'm like again. I sit here going, I don't hate the idea. I don't. It's the fact that I feel like you could replace the characters with anybody that wasn't Lupin and Fujiko and Jigen, and you would get. The oh exact yeah, no, same no. Outcome. That's the that's that that is the biggest flaw of the episode is that it it is a good plot i but like the a, idea but it's, it's a not great a, plot but it's, it's not a good, good lupon episode yeah that's exactly the thing it's a good plot it's not a lupon plot though yeah i mean it could be again if they maybe gave it a longer runtime to play with like but that would have been a decent for TV it to be a 22 minute episode wouldn't it? yeah see see yeah see that that again like i said it works it can work yeah for, but for it to be a 22 minute episode oh i agree to me i'm like because it doesn't give them enough time for the characters to be the characters it doesn't have enough time to cook mm -hmm. yeah like let, thing, let, I like, let oshi cook longer yeah for that like one, I, I think i like it i'm a fan of that episode but i fully acknowledge it's a flawed episode but i like flawed things look at the people i hang out with that's not lauren <laughs> oh shucks <laughs> your your biggest flaw is uh you're easy to point out the weaknesses it just gives someone a dad bond and, 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 and a little bit of a bumbling thing and it's just too oh, easy easy peasy make someone an alex brightman type that's true <laughs> just make them alex brightman and everything's fixed i mean most things can be fixed with alex brightman that's it's why true. they that's why they had to kill him twice and has been. They, they it was too much power. Uh Let's I've see, been what kind of top shit she. Uh hmm. She's always so fashionable. Let's see. Some, something befitting of a margarita. A tube top. That's some f Miami coated shit. Uh, I've been wanting to get into Lupin, but I have no idea where to start. Uh, Lupin the Third, the first. The CGI movie. That's what I was like, you've come to the right place. You've come to the right place. Uh, the first, which is the CGI movie they made in 2019, is a really good start. Mm-hmm. And uh, also has a great English dub, also, also. <laughs> yes. I personally would recommend watching uh, Secret of Mamo before watching, uh... Castle of Cagliostro. Most people would be like, Castle of Cagliostro is the good. No, because that one gives you the expectation of Lupin being a Boy Scout. He is not a Boy Scout. No, this is that was like again for that for hit for uh for Miyazaki's directorial feature directorial debut. Uh, that was actually his send off from working on Lupin. Because fun fact for those who didn't know, 
uh, he worked on the TV series. He worked on parts one and two. Um, and, uh, yeah, he directed a couple episodes of part two. And uh, his send-off to working on Lupin stuff was Castle of Cagliostro. Yeah. And then after that, he went on to make Studio Ghibli. <laughs> so Exactly. But, yeah, I would recommend Lupin the Third the First and um, Suiker of Mamo for your movies. If I had to recommend one of the shows, I would say part four is a really good start. Yeah. I And I, and I know that can be a controversial uh starting point for some people where it's uh you know because i know there's a lot of like you know part two loyalty and stuff like that part two is great but it's also not finished like being dubbed yeah and and that's why that's why i'm like the accessibility factor is also part of my recommendation yes so and and also part four to me i i have a i have a soft spot for part four personally it was one of the it was when I was early on into getting into Lupin. And that part in particular, just super early on, is what really drew me into uh, the group's dynamics, actually. Because it's silly, but it also takes itself seriously enough when it needs to. Mm-hmm. Um, and the characters are just all really well done. They're really well portrayed. Uh, even, and again, like I sit here as a Zenigata loyalist, uh, he gets a lot of great moments in, in part four that really show him being capable and not just being silly, which it's because he, and I know that's the, also the Miyazaki part of my brain going (laughs) that he never liked it when he, he could be silly, but that's not all he is to his character. He's also a very competent, you know, he's a very competent character. He's the only one that can't capture Lupin. Exactly. So that implies how good he is at the at, at capturing everybody else. <laughs> so, yeah, and so I would really recommend get to part five his after skills. part four because you get to meet Yada, and Yada is a very great he, addition. He is such a good boy. Yes, love Yada. Um, but yeah, I would say good way to start would be, uh, the first, uh, Mamo, and part four. And then if you want to get a bit more weird, you know, there's part two and part three, which goes a bit more goofy. And if you want to go serious, uh, basically, uh, Fujiko Mine is a great show. Mm-hmm. And, uh... Really good character deep dive for, for, for Fujiko. Yeah. So, basically, there's a bunch of different flavors of Lupin you can get depending on what you watch. If you want something that's a bit gory and also cool, Goemon's Blood Spray is really good. Mm-hmm. It's the best one of those movies. Uh, but yeah, that, those are my re- those are our recommendations. This is looking great so far. Thank you. She's so happy to pitch stealing a boat. Yeah, it's like. When in Miami, right? <laughs> the, the margarita needs a lime. I know, I'm working my way around. <laughs> I know, I'm, I'm, I'm yanking your chain. Perfect. fucking witchcraft when I see uh, Procreate straighten out the circles and stuff. Yeah, it's it's one of my favorite things about it. Witchcraft. Sorry, this one was taken a bit, but I just want to make sure it's good. Yeah, it's just right. I mean, it's a it's an ambitious one to be the first doodle of the of the stream. So yeah, that, you know that's also a fair point. little flowers and leaves yeah. Yeah, like, yeah it's like a tropical top and yeah. actually I can make this like a like it ties at her waist 
Ah, like, like she's wearing a little sarong. Yeah. This is so cute. I'm glad you think so. I don't think. I know. <laughs> Let's try to make her fingers a little bit longer. Yes. How else does she pick all the locks? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just imagining her having bony ass fingers and that's how she just sticks them in keyholes. <laughs> Don't worry, and... I've got this. Sticks it in the yes. of her long bony fingers. <laughs> and then Lupin's like, I the love bone that woman. Noises. <laughs> she doesn't clip her nails in like weeks, so she has like what those long ass fingernails. Uh, <laughs> that, the that's how that, she like, picks like, the curl. locks. <laughs> yeah, just. Yeah. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> It's like when people have like the one fingernail that's longer than the rest of them and they call that the cr the like the crack finger because then you just put a oh, little yeah. bit under it. That that's hers except it's just for lock picking. <laughs> Pinky it's my up. Lock finger. What do you mean your lock finger? Oh god. <laughs> yeah, the coke nail. <laughs> Lupin would take one look at that. And for the first time and go, what that finger do? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> you know, know he would. I know. I also don't like that Pika Demo said right when you said that superpower unlocked. <laughs> <laughs> Achievement unlocked. Go the distance. Oh. Ah, wonderful work. I am sure oh, I, even Oni just said, I love it! Yay! Let me darken it a little bit there. It's my secret cap. In case it's not dark enough, I just... <laughs> oh, hi, Callie! How you doing? Great when an artist signs her masterpieces. Just hanging, thought Sorry, I'd stop by. No, of course. Enjoy, vibe with us. Yeah. Yeah, I don't get to draw Fujiko too often in my style, so I'm glad she's turning out so well here. Yeah. Perfect. All right. How's that? How, how's that look? Let's see. Michael drumming says. Chat. Dr drumming says wonderful work. Yay! Oh, one. There we go. Okay. All right. So let's see. Uh, well, we're at the seven fifty nine mark. So. I don't know. Well, let's do it. Let's do another. I didn't mean for that to take a... I mean, let's do another doodle and then one more. Can... One more. Yeah. Sure. Okay. So... Oh, this one will, I think will go even faster. Hopefully. Oh, it's Wolfie. <laughs> this one's gonna be Wolfie with the, with his OC and Tigress. Ah. A lot of couples today. Yeah. I I don't think this one's coupley. This one's gonna be more like. Training. Well, couples as in two characters, multiple characters. Oh yes. Like yes. a couple of goobers, you know. <laughs> uh, drumming says thank you so much, Lauren. Yay! Glad to hear it. All right, let's get these furries drawn, and then we'll go to the uh, playlist of uh, of funnies that people sent us. 
Yes. And while you start sketching these furries, I have an announcement, everyone. I need to pee. So I will be right back. <laughs> Go ahead. Go don't piss, girl. Don't miss me too much. Yes, I will be pissing. I am doing well, Crimson. I hope you're doing well, too. I'm glad you could... I'm glad you and all of you could tune in tonight. Wherever the weather... Whatever the weather's doing, wherever you are. It's raining over here in California. Uh, but I'm glad you could join us this Saturday night, or whatever time it is uh, for you, wherever you are. This point of time that we all share. I'm sorry you're tired, Crimson. But I hope this, uh, this stream is, uh, relaxing and restful and, uh, a little bit of, uh, an escape for a bit. That's all right, Joey. I think there's a little bit of chaos in everybody's lives. A little bit right now. So completely understandable. No need to apologize.
Hello, War Doc. Thank you for joining us. I'm glad you can recognize Kung Fu Panda right out the gate, because yes, that's what I'm working on right now. I'm taking occasional peeks over at the chat, so sorry if I miss anything. Oh, the, <laughs> the, uh, the YouTube poop usage of Pingus from Robotnik is coming back. Yeah, it's weird seeing stuff from like 15 years ago. Like coming I back return. into the cultural zeitgeist. Hello! I heard cultural zeitgeist. Uh, I was gonna say, we, uh, Doc mentioned how the Pingus... Robotnik quote is 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 making a resurgence. Ah. Always great like from to like see fifteen years ago. I love the posing so far. Thank you. I love how Tigress is just kind of a tool. Yep. yep, that's why I'm like again. She's she is built for. For fighting and for being like she is just she is built as a tiger she is built for fighting she's, she's built, built for, for fighting and animation yeah llamas with hats returning is the most wild thing to me oh yeah the, aren't they crowdfunding for the yes the and they've already raised the, well over their goal the epilogue yeah. Oh, I, as I was hoping. It's they gonna did. be like apparently it was going It's gonna be the length of all the previous lavas and hats combined. Oh wow. I mean, with the amount they're raising, they could easily make it like a movie at this point. Yeah, I really want. I want to contribute to it so I can get the DVD. It's like a DVD Blu-ray because I'm. I'll, I'd be like, yeah, you know, I'm a bit of a collector. Me with my llama and hats. I wonder if Charlie the Unicorn is coming back. I don't know. I, I don't know if I would want that one too. It's kind of strange how Eggman beca has become a cornerstone of gaming memes. Well, it's because Eggman's like the perfect video game character. He can be dark, but he's also just naturally extremely funny. It's why Wario mm -hmm. and Waluigi it's... work, you know? Like, th 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 it's just, sometimes characters just built like that. Yeah, like an egg. Exactly. And with how many times Wolfie has gotten a commission from you, I feel like Wolfie's OC is just muscle memory at this point. It's funny though, yes and no, because the art style changes based off of whatever yeah, what property he's put into. Ah, that's a great point. So I do have to kind of like relearn his character a little bit. Mm -hmm. Like some things remain like the hair and the and the the, the fighting bands on his like 
hands and feet. Mm-hmm. But, like, a lot of other things change. <laughs> that is true. So it's kind of cool to be able to switch things up. Sorry, you guys, if I'm a little bit less talkative and stuff. Today's been busy. Yeah, you had DA radio earlier today, so yep. that's what I was like. I had DA radio from noon to three, and now I'm having this from six till, you know, onwards. But we're keeping it chill with this one. Yeah, so. we're keeping it chill. And, and luckily, you know, after this doodle, we have more funnies to look at. So yeah, if y'all have any questions or topics you want us to talk about, get, get, shoot them over. <sighs> Key and Abby, are you going to watch the Bluey special tomorrow? Fuck yeah. I've seen so much of it on TikTok already. <laughs> That's what I'm like. I'm, I'm not going to lie that I, I ended up actually seeing somebody had uploaded the full thing. But that was against my will because it... <laughs> I mean, I saw part, most of oh. it in Japanese because I guess it came out in Japan. So that's interesting. How's it in Japanese? Oh, here the little little bluey and bingo in Japanese. But I, I'm I'm ex- I, 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 I want to watch it all as at, they always do. I want to watch it as a full whole thing. Because I think it'll be good. I also love that the the cast and crew are just very much like, yeah, this is basically us testing for if people want this because we want to make a Bluey movie. I would 100% go see Bluey movie. Yeah, you know, screw the Paw Patrol movie. I'm going to the theaters to see the Bluey movie. I don't need those A-cab dogs. I want the... I want the other blue dog. Have you guys ever heard of the Pizza Hut Pizza Steve commercial? Oh, I know those. Those are the ones where the pizza gets brutally maimed in each commercial, right? Yes. Those things used to freak me out. Those I was were like, based- those poor pizzas. And, and those were based on, on another bit. Hmm. If I remember. There was some other comedy bit that was doing it I was trying to remember who did it. And I remember, I swear I remember. I don't know. I'm trying to think of things that use like, yeah, hold on. I'll I'll look that up while you draw. Let's see, pizza, Because I swear I remember there was some kind of controversy that they were like copycatting somebody else for Pizza Steve. Or at least the comedic styling, I guess. The Pizza Head Show was the name of the, uh, Oh, we see, we're mixing it up. So Pizza Head is the name of the pizza. Steve is the name of the pizza cutter that's always hurting Pizza Head. Oh, but, yes. Oh, yeah. It was, uh, so here's, because this has a Wikipedia, because of course it does. <clears throat> the Pizza Head show is a live action advertising campaign used by Pizza Hut from 1993 to 1997 to advertise their promotions and new menu items. The commercial started the commercial starred a slice of pizza named Pizza Head, who had a face made out of different toppings, and his pizza cutter arch nemesis named Steve, who would try to cause him as much harm as possible. These advertising campaigns were produced by San Francisco's Goodbye Silverstein and Partners partners, and were directed by Walter Williams in a style similar to his earlier work, The Mr. Bill Show, which was a series of Saturday Night Live skits. So they were based off. That's right, Mr. Mr. Bill. Bill. That's what it was. Yeah, yes, like that's what uh, I was yeah, because it's the it's a little doll looking thing that's like, oh no. Yes. So I was re- I was remembering it correctly. Yes, you were remembering correctly. I just didn't remember what was the thing that it was based off of. Yeah. Man, what a long advertising campaign. That ran for four years. 
Yeah. You don't see campaigns like that too often. Mm Mm-hmm. I love that this Wikipedia went to the effort of saying each disguise that Steve the pizza cutter was. (laughs) There's... There's Chef Steve, Coach Steve, Super Steve, Engineer Steve, steve it steve it The Stevians, which are aliens that speak to Pizza Head themselves. Uh, the amazing Stevini. Stevie Nix. Oh, God. Princess Steva and Darf Steve. <laughs> And then they had a Johnny Quest crossover, I guess, where you had Johnny Steve, Haji Steve, Jesse Steve, and Quest World Johnny Steve. What a what what inspired choices. Impressive. Yeah, because apparent so like the episode names, which show their promotion, you got episode one, Pizza Head gets crusty, which is no promotion. Then Pizza Head shoots hoops. Which I guess was uh you can get something called a street ball for four ninety nine. Pizza Head to the Rescue, which was a Marvel Comics pack uh, promotion. Which for only two ninety nine you get also a cup, a comic, and a card. I I'm looking at what what were they promoting? They some of these things it's like why would I want this with pizza? Pizza Head's checkup, Pizza Hut Pizza, now with more pepperoni. Uh Goosebumps, and yeah, the Johnny Quest you get when you get a Pizza Hut kids pack. Pizza Hut had a kids meal? Sure. Cause when I think of Well yeah, that makes sense. Like a little kid well, I guess they would have a little kid's pizza. I know, but you know, it's one of those things where it's like I, I guess ingrained in the times we grew up. Like, when I think kids meal, I think like, oh yeah, so there's gonna be a toy with it. The toy is usually toy, promoting something. Yeah. And, and you know, you think yeah. about how, like, major motion pictures would get, like, uh, the the Happy Meal, right? And then the, then yeah. so, and you know, either they would get a Happy Meal and a BK Kids Club toy, or like the B-grade movies get the BK Kids Club toys, and then it just goes downhill from there. Because I'm 90% sure, like, Subway had toys for a little bit, too. Because I'm 90% sure that Mm -hmm. it was Cats Don't Dance got, like, a Subway's Kids Meal promotion or something. Or it was Wendy's or... Like, it's it's a different... Everything's a different leveling system on which Happy Meal do you get. And you know that the Happy Meal is the most popular one because I'm calling it a Happy Meal as its colloquial term. (laughs) You didn't have a Pizza Hut kids meal? I didn't eat Pizza Hut, because I liked myself. <laughs> oh yeah, Pizza Hut had the Land Before Time rubber puppets. I know- I remember the puppets. I know that, because yeah. Saber has them lining his TV. And they're terrifying. <laughs> I'm trying to find I need to I I, I want to remember what was the place where there were it was either that or they had an agreement I think it was that they had an agreement for Cats Don't Dance to get uh, a kids meal thing at one of the restaurants and then they never mm-hmm. did it but the prototypes for the toys were made gotcha Okay, okay, no, they did release a set of toys, and it was for Subway. I was right. I'm a genius. <laughs> I am so smart. SMRT, look at this face and tell me this is not the face of, of, of brain. <laughs> <laughs> I say with my crusty little, little model that has the eye is not in the correct place. 
anyone else buy a Pizza Hut over at Cinemark? I buy the- okay, there is one thing for Pizza Hut I will buy, and it's if I'm going to the Cinemark and they have, like, the giant cookies. Like, the giant cookies. Mm. I will get one of those. Because you can't fuck they up a cookie. Cookies? I call it a cookie. Okay, I'm like, I think Pazuki because I think of BJ's. See, I was calling it a cookie because I'm thinking of the fucking, um... Ah, oh, it's a- it, you, you know the one who makes the dump cakes commercial? Yeah, 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 yeah. She also had, like, um, the ready, oh. set, go, uh, like, uh, thing. And there's, like, an infomercial where she's, like, making a bunch of things and there's, like, 20 ready, set, goes around her. And she makes, like, yeah, a bazooki. Yeah, what was her freaking name? Uh, Patty something? Mm. But, like, yeah, she she puts cookie dough in one, into the ready, set, go, and she's like, I call it a cookie And that haunts me. Because that's such a bad name. So now I use it. I'm co-opting her mistake and making it my achievement. <laughs> All right, good night, Crimson. Have a good Kathy one. Mitchell. Kathy Mitchell. Kathy That's Mitchell. She looks like a patty. Night, Chris night Crimson. I <laughs> know Have you ever had someone say you look like something that's not your name? I'm trying to remember, I swear I've had times of that, but I just, I guess I don't have a... I don't get moments like that very often, so I can't remember when You're a very lore-encoded person. Uh, and that's like, I, I take that as a, I, I definitely take that as a, a compliment, because I, I don't know what would even define a lore, and because so many times in media, uh, there are so many more negative lorens than there are positive ones, and I don't know why that is. I don't know why either. Uh, I've the had only people... positive one, and, and the mm -hmm. only positive one I can even think of, and it's not even positive. It's just because I like the actress is Catherine T. <laughs> <laughs> Am I bothered? Oh, God. Uh, like. I've had people say that I look like a Stella before, which is my grandmother's name. I've had people say that I look like a Mary. I have a lot of people saying I look like names that sound like I'm out of World War II. So it's like, it's... <laughs> I guess I'm a very classical looking person. Yeah, I think that means you just never go out of style, honestly. Yeah, it means you're me, classic. Christine Buca de Beppo. <laughs> As long as neither of you is an Ashley. No. Oh, Ash. Ashley. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. Man, you are so good at drawing Tigress. Oh, thank you. She she too is an adjustment to, to get to learn to draw. As long as you pay attention to all her details. I mean, at least it's not Shen with his million dots. <laughs> yeah, all the not, all not those, Shen Tylon. All those eyes on his. Oh well, I was gonna say Shen has also Shen's the, all also the complicated, feathers. but in a different way. I think the actually the least complicated, and it's weird because you think he would be the most, is it? But he's actually the least because he just doesn't have a bunch of patterns. Is Kai? <laughs> yeah. His weapon is more complicated than himself. Exactly. He's just like a big old ox. <laughs> he's just and he has big. the sickest theme. I'm not gonna lie. And he's chunky, chunky. At, look at, look out! I think Kai the Destroyer likes you. <laughs> and Poe's just staring. And the Chunky song would still work. Yes, Brett. He is. He is big. No, it's uh, it's the Jello banana pudding one. Look, look in the look in the signature creation. That's one of the default ones. All right. Are you picking up cold stone? Brett asked if I wanted a cold stone. Yes. 
<laughs> well, that's why I said. That's why I said. How are you picking up a cold stone? Yes. Because the name sounded very cold stone. <laughs> <laughs> the, I am Banana contributing to decision. big pudding. <laughs> Yeah, it's the right after saying, you know, I think it's it's all conspiracy. I don't think it's ice cream. I think it's pudding. Two seconds later, oh, okay, I'll have the. Uh... <laughs> Here's the thing, it it's yes, that is the correct one. The going bananas one is the correct one. But look, I just want them to admit what it really is, which is also is that it's tasty. So like you know. It's a tasty conspiracy. Also very happy that I, I clicked on Twitter and the first thing that pops up is, uh, I guess Damien from Smosh went into work wearing a mm -hmm. shirt that says just autism and flames with a, with a skeleton <laughs> wielding <laughs> machine guns. And of course, people's first impression was to draw Lyos from Delicious in Dungeon wearing it. <laughs> it's so perfect. I love it. Ah, oh, it's very funny seeing Lyos because it's everyone's just like, God, he's so he's such a he's such a weird guy. Wait, why do I like him? Hmm. Cause he's a weird guy. Yeah, I think people are realizing that weird people are are attractive, and and this is baby's first weird like and. They're going crazy. They let them hit because they're being silly. This is, look at the person I nabbed by being silly and hyper fixated. Yeah. Uh. <sighs> God damn. At least this one should be almost done. It looks almost done. It looks so good. Making sure I get her paw pads right. You gotta get her beans correctly. The beans. The beans. Because they do have very distinct paw pad designs in this universe. Yeah. They have like the... The split in the middle like this. She has like an equal sign on her hand, but flipped the wrong way. Yeah, it's like, I mean, pretty much any any animal that has exposed paws on their hands, that's they all pretty much have some kind of split like that. They're just stylistically drawn that way. Mm -hmm. Or modeled that way. Drawn and modeled that way. Formed. <sighs> Created. Sorry I'm yawning so much. I'm just really, really tired. Don't worry, don't worry. It's fine, Pocahontas. It's fine. <laughs> I'm leaving the tree. No, no, Grandma will stop. I'm coming out of the tree, Grandma. Stop. No. <laughs> Grandma, no, stop. Oh, once we're done with this doodle and we get back to the commercials and we let Duck and Spade back in, I might take a break myself. Yeah, that's fine. You three can putz around. They can, they can, they can go, ha they can go ham while you can take a breather. Exactly. Why do we call Pika? I think they mean biscuits, as in when cats are making biscuits, doing the little kneading thing with their hands. When they're at the bakery. I love the ones where it's like, it's New Year's Eve, they're three days from retirement, and they're still working overtime at the biscuit factory. <laughs> like, I, I... My favorite thing is that both cats I used to have obviously were taken away from their home before they were fully weaned. So not only would they make hella biscuits, they also would suckle on blankets. So whenever you would just go to lie down in the living room and grab a blankie, like there's so many little wet spots from them just... Aww. 
And it's like, oh, this is cute, know. but also I don't like it's the surprise really damp spot. And also really kind of sad because then you're like, oh, they weren't. Oh. Aww. It's always usually when they're like, you know, a week away from when it's usually fully weaned or something. So like they're right on that cusp. Yeah. Cause they'll eat normal food and they're they're like perfectly fine, but they're just they, it's just the it's still providing them comfort. Yeah. You know, and you know, I would rather them suck a lot of blankie than do the thing that they also did, which was see when I had pencils on a desk and be like, well, can't have that. <laughs> I remember my cat Oreo like violently hated pencils and so <laughs> he would just knock them over my little table and I would just stare at him as he's just pat batting them around just like hey, 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 hey. that was the only time I've ever seen this cat have zoomies is when there were specifically mechanical pencils about He specifically had it out for pen for those pencils? He specifically. He never had a problem with normal pencils. Just mechanical pencils. Cats are weird like hmm. that. Yeah, they do have their... They'll pick weird beefs. Yeah. God, that's such a good tigress. Like, the head Thank angle you. you got is just really nice. I I'm really digging it. I love she's so shape. <laughs> she's the most shape ever. She is the shape ever. Meanwhile, you got this lanky motherfucker trying to lay a punch on her. He's like, hit me, hit me, you can't. <laughs> You know what I'm referencing. I here. know what you're <laughs> referencing. I know. All right, another sketch in the bucket. See how much faster that one was? <laughs> yeah, that one was a lot faster. But all right. So, uh, Duck and Spade, if you're still watching and you want to come in, just join General and I'll pull you in. Because now, now yep. we're back. Now let me close out of this. Oh, wrong, uh, wrong screen. Bah, bah, brah. There we go. And now I just need to grab the playlist you sent me. There we go. Holy ducking. All right. So now it is back to yippee! <laughs> yippee! <laughs> Don't look at my screen while I said yippee. <laughs> yippee! Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Breaking news! Oh my Breaking god! Breaking news! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <laughs> This is what is on my browser end too, by the way. I can I, I see that. <laughs> oh yes. all right. I so. like turn it off so we can have the stream there as there well. We like go. there we go. Alright, so I will be taking a break. <laughs> so right now, uh Duck and Lauren and if I when I see Spade come into general, we can add Spade. Uh 
are going to enjoy some commercials that were sent in by you all, and there were quite a few, so I'll let you guys oh enjoy. Oh my god. <laughs> I got my Carvel shake, so I'm ready. So yeah, these are our submissions from you guys. This whole playlist is all from you guys. <sighs> That's why I'm like, I mean, and you guys delivered with many, so hopefully uh, we can all have plenty of laughs and uh, WTFs together over what we yeah. are about to witness. Because I have not gone in to watch any of these. I just linked them. <laughs> so <laughs> you gotta put your Me playing my Nintendo Switch in the middle of the road. (laughs) 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 That's a good one. That's a good one already. Oh, a classic. Ah, the original singing piranha plants. Yeah. Didn't someone like remake this for the new remake? Maybe somebody did. I'm sure somebody did. Yeah, I saw someone reanimate it entirely. And stop motion is so charming. I'm like, what, Dolly? I have syrup on my face. I'll get syrup on your face. Thank you, Dolly. Look how many we have. You like another bite? They're so yummy. Mm mm mm. We have all the eggs to ourselves. Dolly, 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 dolly. Get away from my eggs! <laughs> Woo! Dolly, a uh, chipmunk. Eggo waffles are part of this complete <laughs> breakfast. They're so fluffy the and dumb. Demon, the demon, the skeleton's coming yeah. out. <laughs> oh, that just turned into a Beetlejuice oh, moment or something. Oh, no! Besides, Jones, Jones, you fucking side! Jones, you fucking do you think they're still open? I don't know. That, that's a valid question. Anybody that's it? Okay. What do you think of Wilkins coffee? Oh god, 14 Wilkins minutes? Coffee. Now what do you think oh. of Wilkins? <laughs> Can I have a cup of Wilkins coffee? No, I don't like coffee. <laughs> I freaking uh, Jim was a genius with the peace was never an option for Wilkins Coffee. I actually to went to the coffee. New York the Museum of for? Moving Image and I saw Is these puppets. Oh, that's incredible. Like in person. Yeah, so the little one with coffee, nose is actually never. pink with an orange no, nose, no, and the other one's like no. a tan color, what I learned. That's the official colors that they had. That's amazing. If you don't drink yeah. Wilkins coffee, you're not all there. Oh, that's a lot of... In fact, without Wilkins coffee, you're nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> Just these edible made shit. I wouldn't admit this if I wasn't alone, but I really do like Wilkins coffee. Did you call? <sighs> <laughs> you know, people who don't drink Wilkins coffee just blow up sometimes. Oh, that's a lot of... <laughs> See what <I> mean? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. It's like if Kermit was way more violent. It really is. Take mine with green sugar. (laughs) It's just so good. This was his first puppet career, I think. This was like the first that he ever did. No. Things just seem to happen. (laughs) (laughs) The tree wouldn't have anything to do. It just did it. (laughs) It's just now. Want some Wilkins coffee with your strawberry shortcake? Can't say that I do. You can't say that you don't. (laughs) <laughs> he's just, he's just <laughs> freaking you abusing him. Reminds me of Wilkins Coffee. Why? Because it always hits the spot. Oh. <laughs> he's just murdering him. Anybody who doesn't drink. He Wilkins just wanted excuses to murder this guy right? over and over. Wrong. He always was a bad sport. Oof. They just cover him in tar. I can get you Wilkins yeah, Coffee and for a price. Than... I wouldn't touch it. There's no future in an attitude like that. Drug deal gone wrong. Drug deal's gone wrong. I learned that everybody drinks Wilkins. <laughs> I love those just Give the me back the and eggs forth. And no Wilkins coffee. Give him the eggs, boys. A meal without Wilkins. <laughs> 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 in the mouth. 
Oh. <laughs> oh, that's good. Why are we climbing this tree? For Wilkins coffee. I don't want any. It's autumn. It's <laughs> beginning to fall. <laughs> the small little kick. It's, it's oh, the God, sound it's effects too. Coffee. It is. But I don't drink Wilkins coffee. Some learn, some don't. <laughs> <laughs> How about a delicious cup of Wilkins coffee? No. Strange things happen to people who don't drink Wilkins. <laughs> the government killed him. <laughs> the cover the government wants you to drink Wilkins. I've got five aces. Can you beat that? I've got a can of Wilkins coffee. Nothing beats Wilkins. <laughs> Wilkins guy shot first. <laughs> <laughs> Got sixty-five dollars for a cup of Wilkins coffee? Sixty-five dollars? You want me to go in there looking like a bum? <laughs> <laughs> you have any Wilkins coffee in your house? No. You know a house isn't a home without Wilkins <gasps> coffee. <laughs> the fear in his eyes. I love the, Wilkins the eyes of, of a coffee. serial killer. <laughs> Just kidding, Miss Wilkins. <laughs> That time the Mil Wilkins guy almost got it. Those Wilkins yeah. coffee commercials. You don't like them? No. Then let me fix your stat. <laughs> you can't win. <laughs> well, at least <laughs> that time you didn't. Dude. Be thankful you didn't get hurt that time. Oh my God! Wilkins coffee? No. I spoke too coffee? soon. No. How shocking! How <laughs> <laughs> shocking! <laughs> if you don't start drinking Wilkins oh, coffee, this, this dude, dude is getting, getting everything. <laughs> he always was a cut up. No! <laughs> this dude is just Wilkins Yakko. It's just Yakko as a puppet. Oh, Wilkins makes the best coffee. Congratulations. He got off easy that time. Yeah. Want a cup of Wilkins coffee? What'll Mr. Wilkins do if I don't? Oh, he'll probably... <laughs> <laughs> That's like the... <sighs> God is unhappy. Let's go up to the surface for some Wilkins Don't, coffee. He's gonna cough his oxygen. Oh, never mind. <laughs> coffee break. Want a cup of Wilkins? No, oh, thank you. Now all our workers drink Wilkins. <laughs> When's old man Wilkins gonna pass for all this foolishness? When we sell more Wilkins coffee. Buy Wilkins, will you? The machine tells if you're a good guy or a bad guy. How? All good guys drink Wilkins instant coffee. <laughs> <laughs> it's your present from Mr. Wilkins. But I don't drink Wilkins instant coffee. I know, he just wanted to be remembered. <laughs> if I was gonna be a guy. Oh! <laughs> Are you drinking Wilkins instant coffee yet? No. Okay, let's try it blindfolded. He freaking had one in his <laughs> eye. His eye had an X. He lost an eye. Okay, okay, give me a cup. <laughs> his hospital bills. Darling, if I marry you, will you keep me in Wilkins coffee? Boy, will this be a soggy romance. Howdy, stranger. I hear you don't drink Wilkins coffee. Yeah, so what? Now, are there any other strangers in town? <laughs> <laughs> I just filled my whole swimming pool with Wilkins coffee. Do you think there's children oh, who saw these totally commercials and Wilkins. just got so scared of this puppet who would assassinate them in the middle of the night? I'm sure there say? was. I said there was more Wilkins oh my coffee. God. Boy, I'd give a million bucks for a cup of Wilkins coffee. Okay, Buster, pay up. <laughs> I have Wilkins coffee and another kind of coffee. I want the cheap stuff. Cheap, cheap, cheap. Sorry, but that other coffee... <laughs> that was good! That was good! That, that was actually kind of cute! Hello? Hi, honey, why don't you come over for some coffee? Wilkins coffee? Of course! This girl has taste. This girl has taste? <laughs> Lunch and Wilkins coffee, 75 cents. I didn't drink the Wilkins. That's one dollar even. It pays to drink Wilkins. <laughs> <laughs> hey, the cannibals are boiling us in Wilkins Oh, no. Oh, yeah, no. This is the Scooby Doo stream all over again. Wilkins decaffeinated coffee lets you sleep. Not me. I don't drink it. It lets everybody sleep. <laughs> Peter Peter, coffee drinker, told his wife he couldn't sleep. Now Wilkins decaffeinated coffee lets him sleep so very well. <laughs>
Where, where art thou, Romeo? And where else is my Bro, Wilkins? Bro, pour out a Wilkins coffee, coffee for this gone, man. Gone. Well, so am I. What are those spooks doing? Serving Wilkins tea. It's out of this world. Finest tea <laughs> served. Ghost to ghost. <laughs> Husk of his past lives. One truckload yeah. Wilkins regular coffee? Check. Uh, what was that? Wilkins instant coffee. Check. Throw all the tea overboard, man. I say, this dreadful thing would never have happened if we'd sent them Wilkins tea. <laughs> help, help, my parachute won't open. Wilkins was the answer Try all along. Wil Wilkins It'll would change history. Up. Hello, grocery store? Send me some Wilkins instant coffee. <laughs> How instant can you get? You win a new car or a case of Wilkins instant coffee. I'll take the Wilkins coffee. We'll never get rid of that car. <laughs> <laughs> This thing's sinking. Better throw out that Wilkins Instant Coffee. Just me and Wilkins Instant for 80 whole days. <laughs> <laughs> we, got, we got back to the bottom. Titanic be like. Wilkins Instant Coffee. What about my future? I hate to tell you, but you don't have a future. <laughs> you, can't you notice that his, his fortune teller coffee? name Let's was play? Wilkins Backwards. Oh, okay. That's oh, that's nice. Dog. That's like freaking Yensid. Yep. Merry Christmas! It's a joy to serve Wilkins coffee to so many people at Christmas! It's a joy to you! You're not pulling the sled! After <laughs> Wilkins coffee, sir? If that's all you serve, I'll get off at the next town! Next town's five miles straight down! <laughs> <laughs> no, no <laughs> Wilkins coffee! Do be you drink Wilkins coffee? No! We can still use the apple again! <laughs> Did you drink your Wilkins coffee this morning? <laughs> of course not! Okay! That boy's got a long way to go. <laughs> Wilkins coffee is on the ball. Not the oh, man. No. No. Either get on the ball with Wilkins or get out of the way. <laughs> this, this poor man. You want a can of Wilkins coffee? No, give me a bottle of ginger ale. Okay. But he would have liked the Wilkins. <laughs> I will cut you. Wilkins coffee before you jump? No. You miss no. a lot when you don't drink Wilkins. Oh, imagining in my head is just Moral Combat Fatalities, well, like just the strike. skeleton breaking on this poor puppet. Oh. Yeah. rank 3, you're out! <laughs> Games would be over so quickly if you we sure just did that. Not me, right? The next Moral Combat DLC, this man. Oh god, they should bring it back, these puppets. No. It would be so funny to see like a anniversary commercial just yeah. with these. Do you drink Wilkins coffee? No, I don't. Why? Ooh. Just checking. <laughs> <laughs> ah. I, thought that was a, I thought that was a freaking knife. You gonna Stab. run against the Wilkins coffee party? Start the race. On your mark, get that go. Nobody <laughs> I want to show you something about Wilkins coffee. What? Put your head in here. Wilkins coffee. Well. His eyes. How about a cup of Wilkins coffee? No, just get me down on the ground. Okay. Some people just want to learn. <laughs> I love how they use the pun same punchline, like so, like the other commercials time to time, but What's they do that? it unique. Yeah. So it makes it feel fresh every great. time. Impossible. Oh, I'm convinced. <laughs> Give me a close shave. Do you drink Wilkins coffee? Never. Oh no. My friend, this is gonna be the closest shave you've ever had. Oh, that's funny. I just looked at the pup. <laughs> I look up the puppet's names. Coffee. It's oh, Wilkins, yeah. and Wilkins and Wilkins. And Wilkins. Oh, yeah. <gasps> You won't find anyone who doesn't drink Wilkins instant coffee. Oh, look high and low. How low can you get? <laughs> yum, yum. This Wilkins instant coffee is delicious. And it's even better when it's mixed with boiling water. <laughs> he's, he's lost what it. He's lost it. He's, he's lost his mind. Wilkins instant coffee. Have a cup. What? No. what do you suppose up here? <laughs> If you like really good coffee, Apparition. why not spend the extra money and get yeah, two cans the, of Wilkins? There they are. Why not? After 40 days of this, Noah, I bet you wish we'd brought some Wilkins coffee instead of those silly elephants. <laughs> 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 elephant! 
Wilkins. I'm gonna drink this coffee and it's not Wilkins. <gasps> no! <laughs> no, they fled. No, I've been imprisoned. Why? They want to make an edit of that with Dio. <laughs> well, that's the way the old ball bounces. <laughs> <laughs> But, but, what's wrong? Mr. Wilkins says cut the kidding and tell him Wilkins decaffeinated coffee is the best you can buy. They finally agree on something. He finally Wilkins agrees because he doesn't want to be killed. <laughs> Don't forget the Wilkins. Awake, Sleeping no. Beauty, it's Prince Charming with Wilkins coffee. I don't drink Wilkins. I've waited a hundred years for this old hag. <laughs> Give me some party line coffee. Oh, oh no. Wilkins, comrade. That's capitalist coffee, you traitor. Send two pounds to the back door. Our Wilkins. Free? Want some Wilkins coffee with your dinner? No, give me some water. People like that need brainwashing. Uh? <laughs> uh? One of us has to go me or this Wilkins coffee. Let's leave it to the hand of fate. He must be <laughs> <laughs> God, whoever what put this in, thank you. Ton. What was that? Another ton of Wilkins just arrived. <laughs> <laughs> what happened to my car? Do you drink Wilkins coffee? No, so what? Well, things seem to happen to people who don't drink Wilkins. Oh my god! <laughs> I grew this rose in Wilkins coffee. Why? So I could have the beauty of a rose and the fragrance of Wilkins. <laughs> Okay, kind of let's try that. <laughs> Mythbusters, does Wilkin coffee actually work? Make, make your flowers smell like coffee. Wilkins will be the first coffee on the moon. Now what? Wilkins coffee is still the best on Earth. <laughs> <laughs> the, the freeze, like, like the freeze moment of him just... <gasps> wow, <this is anger. gasps> Timmy? Oh no, not this oh, commercial! Oh, I know this one! You bet! Mom! Dad! It's really him! Hold on! Hold on! Now I'm Oh! Oh! No! God, I love multiverses! Don't tell my sprite to do anything but point your thirst. <laughs> Introducing new sour bubble tape. How much sour can you handle? Wow! Bubble's gonna die. Uh oh. Oh no. What'd you learn at school today? Never go last. New sour apple and sour blue raspberry bubble tape. That's a poor frying frame. Yeah. And I had the dare to drop ones with the Uno Maz. <gasps> Sir, I think you should get that checked out. <laughs> he looks like Robbie Rodden with the jaw. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously, dude, I think you need an emergency room. Yeah, he needs an emergency room. What? <laughs> I think they need Wilkins. <laughs> <laughs> you heard they didn't like weapons. Yeah. Yeah. Oh shit! Oh. No! You're not for astronauts! That's so good. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh my god. Dr. Pepper Godzilla commercial. The monster! The monster! We must stop looks so good, before dude. he destroys the city. <laughs> Bruh, I think you did. <laughs> for Anisa Snickers. A prayer <laughs> for the whole world. <laughs> what could he want? Unless we find something to appease him. Hold 
<laughs> the one thing in color. Oh my god. <laughs> be the be the homies drinking Dr Pepper at 5 a.m. 5 a.m. <laughs> Godzilla's Kong. <gasps> what is this? <laughs> poop. <laughs> it's poop. <laughs> Fred <Fresh> poop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's doing the poop on him. Oh, he's okay. <laughs> he's okay. God, they're going through such unima like, un unimaginable horrors. When is this gonna end? <laughs> it's raining. Like so dramatic. <laughs> the payoff would be good. Syria. No <laughs> 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 goofy calls. <laughs> oh now now we're talking oh. here. Spice. Oh. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, you're adorable. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad the team did that. They were able to do that quick animation for this. That was, it's so cute. Guys, go watch this movie. Lauren worked on it. Yep. Stand back. I'm gonna kick my butt. And Kung Fu Panda fanboy I know submitted this one, so you know what? I have to honor his request. <laughs> Understandable. A JT's Chrysler Jeep Dobbs in the Yes, the classic! Oh, the classic! Moon! It's dear Tastic Me! That is the most easy decision you ever make! From now to the end of the month, pay zero down! Guys, guys, tag yourself with, with like what minion Jeep suits you best. Jeep I'm that minion Tastic right there. Save 8,000 on Chrysler 300. I'm that one. <laughs> that was Chris. That's a lot of good stuff. You are only going to get that at the JT's Chrysler Jeep Dodge in Lexington. Do what? JT'sJeep.com. <laughs> oh my god. Eagle so man, sure. what's this one? What's that? Do you have insurance on this car? No. It must be Eagle Man. <laughs> you can see the reflection <laughs> in the car. I've got something <laughs> for you. What? Hi. Hi, early bird. Wait, no. He did not just lay an egg. Oh, look at those low rates! <laughs> is, is the name of the child low rates? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I believe this one's this one doesn't have subtitles, but it's pretty visual. Yeah, he's basically is basically he's obviously making fun of them. Yeah, <sighs> that freaking guy. He only looks like he looks like one of the freaking uh, aliens from Men in Black Four, like the freaking like insect yeah. looking aliens. <gasps> what the what? fuck? <laughs> Become <laughs> annoying orange. <laughs> <laughs> the oven, not the oven. They're just. <laughs> it's, just it's just an annoying orange bit. <laughs> no. What? <laughs> it's love. It's just. <laughs> 
Sniping. <laughs> is he still gonna laugh? No, he's not laughing anymore. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Kasi pwedeng fresh pa rin. Julie's. Remember, chat, if you drink Julie's, you become him. Just eating. Long, long man. Six minutes? I know about this one. So. <laughs> oh, it's him! It's him! I know so <laughs> It's the, the legend. I forgot about him for a second. Long. <laughs> <laughs> this is my first time seeing this in the oh. <laughs> I want a video game or TV show just about long man. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Do you have to? <laughs> no! 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 Long distance to it. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> she came ready with a chart. See the same. <laughs> oh my god. ちいちゃん聞いてもいい何プロポーズってどんな風にされたいえ小直に言ってごらん。フラッシュモブは嫌かな。え、なんかこっぱずかしいし、フラッシュモブ。ちいちゃん、ぶっそけこう。ラン、
Thank God. Thank, thank God. I can't forget <laughs> you. Oh my God. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> This is amazing. Oh my god. <laughs> Every okay. fucking time. The long tail? It's always been about oh. the yaoi. <laughs> it was always you. <laughs> <laughs> Always been Yaoi. <laughs> oh. So it's Yaoi always has been. <laughs> a good man too. Sawate me to Eeska. Yeah. <laughs> This is the greatest story! I love her just- No, 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 no! Such a great it's series. It's freaking amazing. <laughs> Bro, the wrinkles oh, on that head! I remember this! Oh my god! <laughs> Forever! Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the cream filling? <laughs> now that's stuff. Hostess. They just wanted Twinkies. Sticky situations. Is that Jason? Oh no, that's not. That's no. that's uh. It's just another Vic. slasher. Yeah, that's that's his cousin nope. Vic. Not again. Make me look like an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> gorilla. They come back and there's a gorilla? gorilla, gorilla. <laughs> Chris has act- Chrissy, you missed the freaking long man commercial. Oh, I saw it. Well, not too much glue. A little goes a long way. Oh, okay. <laughs> we were losing our shit. Oh my god. He's helping. We did it. He's helping, <laughs> helping you. Oh no. Look at that. Ooh. Yeah, it seems like that. Um. <laughs> gorilla, help. <laughs> Bud Riser Frogs, what's this one? And Nicola, yeah, I think that was Tress McBeal as the vulture. Mm-hmm. Why? Why? Realistic frog physics. Yeah. <laughs> Why? <laughs> no? I'm gonna fuck this frog! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's what croaking is. <gasps> Mario Bros. for Atari? Oh, wait, is this the cl- is this the one for you? Oh, yes, this one. <laughs> <laughs> Say the line, Luigi. I always forgot this was on Atari, I think, before the NES. <laughs> he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Bud Light in a can band, Ooh, a band commercial. commercial. I got it in the can for the first time last night. I loved it. I don't really enjoy getting <laughs> as much as I do. 
<laughs> give it to my boss in the can. I'm getting it in the can. I've only had it in the can once, but I'm definitely getting it in the can again. <laughs> in the can in a week. I'm gonna get it in oh the can God. in about five minutes. <laughs> times I've had it in the can. Who told you I like it in the can? Who told you I like it in the can? I was getting it in the can. <laughs> BL is for boy love. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, Sonic. Oh, yes, yes. I think I know. Is this the, the one I'm thinking of? Yes, this is it. This I love this commercial. Mesh. You have freaking so we like have you have Sad AM Robotnik, Sonic Adventures, Curves Sonic and Tails. Given blessings for what? <laughs> in our daily lives. Use the power of herbs. Maxi Atletica. <laughs> what Xavier <laughs> animation is this? Where are they for getting your stuff? well being? I say him child for your health. Oh god, Ice Age. Didn't they add him to that Disney game recently? Yes. Nice of you to help me demonstrate how to use a soda stream machine. Okay, what? Like yep, that's how you know <laughs> Thank you, Luigi. You like and enjoy. You are so right, pal. This soda stream revolution could mean an end to millions of plastic bottles. Ice Age and Soda Stream Limited Edition now Why? in stores. Why? I don't know. Rap, rap, rap. rat. Biggie Cheese? <laughs> oh, oh, that's not. Oh, that's not what it's called. Oh, um, that's Large Larry. <laughs> Large Larry. Oh, the editing on this is. Oh, the editing on this. Oh, what is going on? <laughs> me, me cutting my animation reel for time. <laughs> I'm gonna be sick. <laughs> this, is, this is like one of those videos that someone would like it's make them go <gasps> Sonic pasta So many Sonic ones. Babe, are you okay? You touched your Sonic yes. pasta. I love this one! Uh oh. Hang on, hang on, this is the best line. <laughs> what are you playing for lunch? I love this one. What? Oh, yes, sponge, the sponge monkeys. monkeys. Oh, I haven't up. heard of this. Oh, these things. What the f yep. <laughs> What? They are good to us. What the they fuck is this? It's like a freaking creepy pasta. This is actually one of the first examples of an internet thing coming to traditional Jesus. Mm, toasty. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Shark wants to eat Steve. Steve Minecraft. Oh, I think I remember this one. Hold on. Okay, so which one tasted better? Uh, Steve. Yes. Guy. With Lisa, I only tasted peanut butter and chocolate. <laughs> Lisa had just eaten a peanut butter cup. <laughs> <laughs> I tasted something more. It was peanut butter and uh, Snickers. Peanut butter. Right. Snickers. Yeah, Steve had just eaten Snickers peanut butter. <laughs> 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 I don't know why I see the sharks. All I think about is Shark Boy and Lava Girl going, yeah. Don't hurt him, he's one of us. If you like peanut butter and chocolate, you'll love peanut butter and Snickers. Try Snickers Peanut Butter Squared. <laughs> oh, How's, Hippo? Hippo? How's Hippo? We love you, Canada. It's nighttime in a kitchen just like yours. 
All is quiet. <laughs> or is it? The North American house hippo is found throughout Canada and the eastern United States. <laughs> house hippos are very timid creatures so and are rarely seen. Unlike but actual they hippos. Their territory from yeah. boat. They come out at night to search for food, water, and materials <laughs> for their nests. The favorite foods of the house hippo are chips, raisins, and the crumbs from peanut butter on toast. Imagine if that was real. They their nests in bedroom closets using lost mittens, dryer lint, and bits of string. The nests have to be very soft and warm. House hippos sleep about 16 hours a day. They're just ferrets. Yes, All these are just, just you describing aspects true, of ferrets. You? That's why it's oh. good to think about what you're watching on TV and ask questions, kind of like you just did. A message from Concerned Children's Advertisers. <laughs> sure. <laughs> well, what, what if we can't? What if we want house? Oh, how to train your dragon? New Year's Eve. <laughs> Oh, that's right. I think I did get a few How to Train Your Sorry, Dragons in here, so... Someone took the ball. Toothless is the gonna ball. steal the New Year's ball! Oh my god, oh. I was right! No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> Toothless! <laughs> that is not yours. Hand it over. Alright. Just put it back before midnight! <laughs> I'm getting too old just for this shit. Oh! <laughs> Oh, I'm a cutie. Oh, another one. That's what I said. I think there's like three this dragon one's, ones in yeah. this place. Alright, roll sound. Roll camera. Okay, Chip. Uh, it's Kit. Yeah, I need you to feel it. It's cold. It's gray. You're covered in pelts. Uh, oh, and you're auditioning with some big Hollywood star. Oh, really? Who? <laughs> and action! Hold, brothers. The beast can smell your fear. Dragon, show yourself. <laughs> I love two oh, Sorry, I, uh, I didn't see that in the script. Was he just oh, a baby? Got the <laughs> <laughs> ah! Punch him. <laughs> Mate, it's your bit. All you need to do this is, thing is leap just a on cat. this mark when I say, yep. ah! No, 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 no. Oh! <laughs> I was just like, I got the it. Q. The Q is ah. No. I was trying to see if I have any commercials, <laughs> and I found the freaking Superman versus Nico team. Because half the time, I'm just trying to remember where I left my keys. You're gonna love that one. Brothers, it's just a nicotine commercial. We'll see daybreak, but <laughs> dragon, <laughs> show yourself. Tooth this? No, no. Put it down. Put it down. <laughs> 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 Catering's top notch, mate. I got you the salmon. <laughs> salmon! You know what that means? I'm a little Fish. confused about my part, really. I mean, first I'm dead, then I'm not. No one knows who my mother is. Brothers, <laughs> we have fought. <laughs> Look at him in the background. We have fought hard. It's so And we must continue to fight until our foes are defeated. Play his hand off. <laughs> oh, oh. Yes. can you get him cleaned up, please? <laughs> <laughs> Get screwed over baby. by a cartoon character. I just heard Brett go, so I assume he got to the part of the spit. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. All right, Vikings, your goal is to get the popcorn and the cauldron popped. Sound easy? Yeah. Well, let's put a few obstacles in your way. Go, go, go! Being a Viking wow. means you've got to I be tough. I count every pixel on the screen right now. <laughs> There's like Sonic Generations on the Xbox Series S. This theater reminds you refreshing non flammable concessions are available in the lobby. How to train your dragon reminds you to enjoy the show. Thank you, Gomer. For the first one. Needs a little butter. <laughs> Juan La Fanta. Bounce? Okay. Big Frida. 
Bounce TV. Call me Juan LaFanta because I'll fight for you. The oh. original it's, Saul yeah, Goodman? It's not, it's, this is fighting my computer, Man, apparently, go? too. LaFanta, what, what are you doing? <laughs> LaFanta is breaking the computer. We started it off, it looks like Saul you. Goodman, like uh, how he does his stuff. Man, why you look so serious? We gotta bounce this out. Remix! Oh, he fight, he no way. What? Hi, hi, ha, ha, what is going on? Everything. Juan Lafanta. 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 Man, the lyrics are fine. They thought really hard about these lyrics. Now that's how you bounce a commercial. <laughs> Flea Ma Market Montgomery? Montgomery? Long version. <laughs> oh my god. This? Oh. Living rooms, bedrooms, dinettes. Oh yeah, you can find them at the market. <laughs> we talking about Flea Market Montgomery. It's just like, it's just like a mini mall. Oh, I actually <laughs> know this ad. They, you do? Yes, because they parodied it on Family Guy. Oh my god! Like, <laughs> wait, wait, they the Family it on Guy. Family one. Guy or Cleveland Show? Hold on. Uh, I love how half your. I love how half your premium is Family Guy clips. <laughs> <laughs> like, wow, I wonder how she would have known that. Oh, yeah. Oh, Cleveland did it. <laughs> okay. And then I tried my hand as a singing spokesman for a furniture flea market. Living room, bedroom, dine it. <laughs> we got it. You need it. You'll find it. It's just like, it's just like a mini mall. Hey, hey. You heard me. Come shop. I said flea market. Stool band. It's just like, it's just like a mini mall. Hey, hey. Living room, bedroom, dine it. Oh yeah. Yeah, so I know this because of fucking Cleveland show. <laughs> Cleveland. <laughs> it's just like it's Cleveland just was like ahead of us. Wait, will we play both audios together? No. <laughs> we got it. You see it. You find it. It's just like it's just like a minimal. Hey, hey. Well, they really just did this as like they really a, did it. It really was just a frame by frame it's remake. Like, it's just like this is who we need for DA Games commercials. It's just like, it's just like a mini mall. Hey, hey, don't stop. Oh, I mean, if we can do a DA Games music video that's just now. like this, I would love it. <laughs> it's for the hardest song Will's ever made in the music video, just him dancing in a furniture store. Montgomery. <laughs> <laughs> this is this is what the like, I am the purple guy like music video is gonna be the new one. We make fun of this. This will be stuck in our heads for a Montgomery. week. I'm probably gonna have the Wilkins coffee. It's just like. He's just sitting there! You know what I mean? It's just like... You know it! So why don't you just come on and say it? It's just like... It's just like... It's like... It's like... It's just 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 like... I'm gonna it. wake up to the, the... The Sammy Stevens mall rap... And then the Sammy Stevens mini mall rap... And then the tagline is... It's just like a mini mall. How many times do you yeah, have a mini mall? I'm going to freaking wake up in the middle of the night sweating, and I'm just going to- It's just like a mini ball. The boiled man is going to be just singing that song to you when you turn off the lights. We're down for a dollar! We're going 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 
Downers for the country and peak <laughs> That's the place to go. Downers for the country. That's peak the place to go. Oh, wow. Well. Okay, oh, I'm wow. going to save this to add <laughs> just because I'm going to send that to Will and Chris and be like, okay, I know how we do our Momocon announcement. Can you two just do this in the call and be like, that's the place to go. That's the place to go. That's the place to go. <laughs> <laughs> Come on down, no, no, no. Oh no, there's Come another down, one. No. There's another one. There's more to the lore of Downer. We're going Downer, Downer, Downer. 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 This is in furniture and champagne in Danville, Illinois. Like this three piece set, sofa love seat chair at a whopping low $269. Gotta go Downer. Okay, $188. Large ceramic oh. floor lamps, so $149. Oh, okay, down. how about $49? Solid my bug bed's only $98. Oh, okay, how about $48? Oh, Your friends are saying, your relatives say things are too high all over. Downer, downer, downer. This is in furniture. Champagne. <laughs> that that oh, one's Chris that and Will. That one's moment. Chris and Will. <laughs> Just because of the laugh. 1999 Corolla Toyota oh, Craigslist. This one, was, this one was one I got was a warning that was a. You um, want a car that gets the NSFW? job done? You want a car that's hassle free? You want a car that literally. This is, is I got. NSFW? I think this is one that was submitted. How is it? I, I don't know. I'm. Like, I'm, I'm I'm curious. I haven't seen it. I am curious. So Chrissy, maybe put the, maybe put like the BRB screen on just in case we can skim through and see what it is. Uh hold on. It's easier for me to skim when I think it's mostly text. Okay, so it's mostly text, so Let's see the come let's see. This is magical. This should be in every voice actor's demo reel. <laughs> okay, so maybe it's not so bad. Okay. Yeah. Should we take it's the gamble? Ad. Okay. It's reading a Craigslist ad. Alright. Let's see. It can't be that bad. Uh, okay. But after this one, we may need to... I know we promised another hour of drawing, but I'm not feeling that good right now. Okay. I don't know. That's... Yeah. Well, whatever I have up on the list, I'll be able to do off the yeah. in that. Oh, I know. You're, yeah, you're, whatever you're, you got. You're you're a fast lady. I'm just also. Yeah. I'm very uh, tired. I'm yeah. I've been streaming for over six hours today, basically, and I'm not feeling too great. Yeah, you deserve you deserve a break, bud. Trust me. Yeah. Yeah, Literally, but don't worry, no chat. Lauren gets it done anyone. quick. Well, look no further. The 1999 yeah. Toyota Corolla. Let's talk about features. Bluetooth? Nope. Sunroof? Nope. <laughs> Fancy wheels? Nope. Rear view camera? Nope. But it's got a transparent rear window and you have a fucking neck that can turn. Let me tell you a story. <laughs> One day my Corolla started making a strange sound. I didn't give a shit and ignored it. It went away. The end. You could take the engine out of this car, drop it off the Golden Gate Bridge, fish it out of the water a thousand years later, put it in the trunk of the car, fill up the gas tank with Nutella, turn the key, and this puppy would fucking start right up. This car will outlive you. It will outlive your children. Things this car is old enough to do. Cook? Yes. Consent to sex? Yes. Rent a car? It is a car. This car's got history. It's seen some shit. People have done straight things in this car. People have done gay things in this car. It's not gonna judge you like a fucking Volkswagen would. Interesting facts. This car's exterior color is gray, but its interior color is gray. In the owner's manual, oil is listed as optional. When this car was uh -huh. unveiled at the 1998 Detroit Auto Show, it caused all 2,000 attendees to spontaneously the, the resulting abrupt change in air pressure inside the building caused a partial collapse of the roof. Four people died. The event is chronicled in the documentary Bored to Death, the story of the 1999 Toyota Corolla. <laughs> you want to know more? Great, I had my car fill out a Facebook survey. Favorite food? Spaghetti. Favorite TV <laughs> Alf! show? Alf. Favorite band? Tie between Bush and the Gin Blossoms. This car is as practical <laughs> as a Roth IRA. It's as middle of the road as your grandpa during his last silver alert. It's as utilitarian as a member of a church whose <laughs> oh scripture God. is based entirely on water bills. When I ran the Carfax for this car, I got a single piece of paper that said, It's a Corolla. It's fine. Let's face the facts. This car isn't going to win any beauty contests, but neither are you. Stop oh. lying to yourself and stop lying Ow. to your wife. This isn't the car you want. It's the car you deserve. The fucking 1999 Toyota Corolla.
That was great, honestly. Okay, that was great. I and there's Homestuck. Buy a Toyota Corolla. Oh my god. Oh, but that's a good way to end it. Folks, thank you for joining. Yeah. Uh, oh god. Thank you for joining, and thank you people who got uh, commissions from Lauren. She's got her hands full for the next couple days. A um, lot, mm -hmm. lot of good requests. And, mm -hmm. uh, yeah, we will let you know the next time we, I promise that the next time we do this, I will have more energy so we can do the proper, uh, two hours of drawing, two hours of fun times. Uh, yeah. you know, we'll, we'll do it on, on a, we'll, that we'll do it on a day when we'll... I'm not, uh, doing a, another three hour stream before this one. Uh, what was the stream yeah, yeah. you're doing three hours before? DA radio. It was the DA radio. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, so. I didn't even see a notification for that one, probably because it worked. Yeah, but like uh Lauren, I hope you had a good time. I did. This was this was a fun one. Yes. And we'll do more of this uh when we do. Well, follow us on Twitter and everything and you'll actually uh uh find out when. Don't worry, me and Lauren are always planning fun things to do for sister time. So uh Yeah. And then and now we actually also have for for uh announcements we already have some announcement like template stuff ready so we can basically send that out when we have uh, plans for another stream like this soon exactly Ooh. so yeah. uh yeah go you know lauren always has her color splash commissions up uh on her twitter mm -hmm. so check her pin tweet if you want something a bit more detailed a bit more refined a bit more cool and colorful uh and uh yeah because i'll be breezing through these sketches pretty quickly so uh yeah because i'm almost done with a bunch of them and so basically yeah i'll be open to to taking i mean i'm always open to taking more uh, color i do want to so i, I want to ask the stream like uh you know because uh if we if we did like si these sister streams like uh like if we plan it on a day of the week so like near the end of the week would you guys rather have the pre-stream commission thing up the day, just the day before the stream? Or would you guys want it to be like, hey, the week leading up to it, if we say we did like uh, another one of these on next Friday or something, let, let's throw a day. Yeah. Would you want the pre-stream thing to be up on Monday so you guys have time to put in your pre-stream commissions? <clears throat> what, what would you in the chat think? To like give them like, a, like five days to load up? Yeah, just to, you know, Figure, yeah. out, figure out an idea, throw some time, you know. Yeah. Yeah, now it's a Monday, then Friday. Yeah, that that would seem fair. Yeah. Gives you time. Whatever to, they want to. Gives yeah, you time to see reason. the request and be like, okay, which one of these is like good for on stream, not good for on stream, <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, the stream's good with the, me. the chat's seeming like, yeah, they like the lead up time. So we'll we'll think about that and all and all that gives us all more preparation time and everything. But till then. I'm going to go sleep because <laughs> I have to do yep, another DA sleep. radio stream tomorrow. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, I yep. got awkward cast off this week because Max's family over. But instead, I get to do a radio show again. Wee. Uh, but till then, everyone, have a great night and we'll see you when we see you. <laughs>